So join Daddy Rude and Lady Cleo on a Friday night, 9 to 12, for Real Talk, the show where we discuss all that's real and nothing ideal, only on Styles FM. And with that said, indeed, welcome, welcome, welcome all my wonderful listeners of Styles FM and, of course, of Real Talk. A very special night to you all tonight. It is the last Friday, the last Real Talk for 2017. Can you believe another year has ended for us on Real Talk? Can I tell you, it's just absolutely beautiful and we're thankful that we have seen another year and of course let me just tell all my wonderful listeners out there tonight that this show would be impossible and so incomplete so incomplete without you all whether you called in or not whether you text us or not this show would not have been what it is without all of you out there in Radio Land, those on the World Wide Web. And on behalf of my crazy co-host and myself, we just want to thank you for sticking and staying with us all through the year. Those ups and downs and ins and outs, you were with us. We totally, totally appreciate love you tonight. And we say God bless you all and thank you and keep it going because we're on that million and one mark yeah where the listenership is concerned so i don't want to start calling names tonight because trust me i am going to miss out on a whole lot so what i'm going to ask you guys to do as we go through the show please just um if you haven't even texted us in a long time send a message on the whatsapp or the regular text saying hey and make sure your name is dear so i can remember who you are and big you up because i cannot call all the names tonight off the tip of my head right but of course big ups to our regular listeners big ups to those persons in portland who spread the word and keep locked you know, to the station every Friday night. When we were on Mondays, they were there with us. When we switched to Fridays, oh, you came along with us. And we just really, really, really appreciate you. We haven't given a shout-out. I haven't given a shout-out to Miss Richards and her twins and her kids. They're in Anchovy. She's always listening to Real Talk, and I haven't given you a shout-out in a long time. So, Miss Richie, don't worry, girl. I remember you. I remember you. And, of course, Celia and Hobby. Mr. Johnson, yes, you guys are always locked in as well. And to all our other friends in Portland, all those in St. Mary, thank you guys so much. All those in St. Thomas, St. Anne, we really, really thank you. All those across the length and breadth of this beautiful island, those who watch on the World Wide Web every night. It, no, the show don't miss you. And if it even miss you, you go back and watch it. Yeah. You I'm talking to, Vivian, always locked in. Big ups to my dear friend, my dear girl, Diane, and of course, Five Star Crew. Uh, big ups to Kirk and everybody who listen in. And can I tell you, people who are spreading the word far and wide, big ups to Sivan, Sivan who is spreading styles and real talk all the way in London. Big ups, big ups, big ups, big ups. And, of course, the big ups cannot be too much. All right? Thank you so much, guys, for your support. And we really, really appreciate it. Yeah? So, tonight in studio, we have Cassidy, our engineer. It's the last time I'll be seeing him for 2017. You going to miss me? For 2017, on the show. <laughs> on the show, yes. You going to miss me? Of course. That's rude. Are you going to miss me? And that's a rhetorical question, but are you going to miss me? Why? You're not seeing me till next year. Why? We are next year not to, you, before you see me again, you know? No, 2018. The mic is on, Cass. Please make your mic be up. I'm going to ask why. Yes. <laughs> why? Why not? I mean, why should I miss you? I am your better one-eighth. 
This is Jackson's half. Which, 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 which means that. Which means that. Which. Mean. <laughs> so I'm going to give. Him, I'm putting it to one eighth. So that fraction. Mm -hmm. If Cleo is not there, you're in trouble. Yeah. So you're gonna miss me. Say it, Say yes, man. I'm That's thinking. One, so. I'm thinking about it. I'm number one coffee tonight, you know, because I lost. I'm night. thinking I lost about for it the, for the year. Why would I miss Lady Cleo? Okay, listeners, please tell him uh, oh. why he would miss Lady Cleo because he's not going to so, see so, me again for now. So I'm going to ask a question. Do I usually <laughs> miss Lady Cleo? <laughs> <laughs> uh, people, can I tell you, we are, we are such great friends. Can I tell you? Um, greater friends off air than we even are on air. Yep. And yeah, even with Bex and then Bex with me. I'm going to back with them. It's, like, for long, you know? <laughs> it's never for long, can we, I tell you? We war to war again. <laughs> <laughs> but it's been a wonderful year with my crazy, crazy, crazy co-host. And I'll do it all over again and you again know, and again. You know so you're going to miss me? Only if you want to know a secret. Yes, tell me the secret. I'm wondering if you're going to miss me. Belly, I caught me. <laughs> <laughs> it's too early for that secret. <laughs> Uh, take it back, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> I'm tear down. Too early. I oh, can't manage. I'm trying to go for water. Oh, clear. Lord. <laughs> Even if I could cut this early, my youth. What do you eat now? No. Man, no. Which cup of <laughs> air did you put on your throat? You know, Lord. <laughs> A-I-R. <laughs> A I R. No man, H A I R. Man, you remember my goat teeth, what you? Oh my goodness. Hey. He has a way of putting um, airy stuff, goat things in his mouth, people. For those who don't know, that he is always eating some flesh, fleshy part, an airy part of the. Well, it was a goat, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're not sure which part he got, but he's always. The last time I remember, he had some airy glump. Ugh. Yeah, nice <laughs> fat glump of thing going down in a cup, from a cup. And then the last time we, we were together again, <laughs> he had a, no. a, 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 um, a, a, a goat's it tooth. It didn't go down. <laughs> it didn't go down? No. Remember that they had chew, I'm at chew, I'm at chew. is laughing at you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at chew. And when we <laughs> cast the lock out himself. <laughs> uh, you are chewing on the airy stuff? Oh my god! You're skilled like that? Well <laughs> I had um goat head soup, people. We're not sure if it's goat head. And or goat somewhere else. But anyway, you had goat. I'm a can't tell the Saint Thomas people, it's a restaurant in a Saint Thomas. <laughs> right? <laughs> and um did it tastes good. <laughs> I should. <laughs> and we eat. I'm gonna get some meat. I'm gonna chew. I'm gonna chew. I'm gonna chew. I'm realize I chew in our deserve. I didn't know the details before tonight. In our deserve. So, I said, hold on. I want him to the meat here. Oh my goodness. So, I picked out now one clump of here. It's not meant to be. It's not meant to be eaten off. It's meant what? to just be. Be eaten and then you go back and you eat again. So I don't know what you were trying to do. Get it all down. Are you sure it's goat meat? Thank you, Carlene in New York. Big up yourself, girl. I don't Carlene, think it was. To be quite frank with you, I can't tell you what. <coughs> because <laughs> it was a clump of hair. Oh my <laughs> That's God. all I know. But you ate the meat off. You ate off the meat part already and left the air. Yeah. See, so you see them sharp? <laughs> <laughs> People. My co-host is what? just the best so, at eating clumpy stuff. No. <laughs> so since that, <laughs> I've been very observant. <laughs> very observant. But I haven't had, um, I haven't had, um, what do I call it now? Beef and mutton, goat meat, all them something like about a Ew. year. About a year and a couple <laughs> months now. <laughs> Colleen, go easy. <laughs> Take time. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh. and then the other day, you know, mm -hmm. we were at a wedding, mm -hmm. <laughs> and me again, salt again. <laughs> uh. Say, all right, me drink some goat. This is after over a year you now, and I have not 
eating, just, just fish, chicken, vegetables, blah, blah, yada, yada. <laughs> About four goat teeth stick up together oh in, a, in a the soup people. and me get. People. Of all oh, Jesus. the people, and me get it again. Can I tell you? And he had the audacity to draw my attention. I was, I didn't even want to see because I kept, all I could do was just re reflect on the time when he had a clump of airy stuff in, stuff in the cup and he was eating on that. So when he drew my attention to this, to this teeth now in his plate, look here in the man, I nearly flipped. Can I tell you? It was absolutely funny. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> oh, Kevin in Tampa, Florida. Hi, Kevin. Thanks for being with us throughout the year, can I tell you? He says, as the year come to an end, Styles FM Real Talk should have top 10 most remembering love. Oh, talk you, talk you, talk you. <laughs> Real talk, can Kevin. Can I tell Real you, talk, if Real I talk. think of all the times I laughed on this show, I think my... my my cheeks would just like go up there and can't come back down. It's, oh. So can we have a, a laugh on you now? There is nothing to laugh about. It's a pity we <laughs> never ask Cassidy <laughs> to find the clip. Ah, what's the clip was <laughs> You remember the one? Don't let okay. me start laughing. You shouldn't reach anywhere yet, man. You have an idea what I'm talking about, right, Cass? <laughs> you have an idea what I'm talking about? The clip with Cleo. Oh, when boy. When we talk about the fountain. Oh, look here. I knew you were going there, you know. I just knew you were going to go. Cassidy, don't laugh. It's not funny. You don't think you can find it. So, ladies uh, and germs, uh, we were having man. a show going on, quite fine, and we're talking about um, how to keep young, etc., etc., etc. And I said, um, <coughs> and, would you, and would you drink from the fountain of the youth? <coughs> Clear ball out. Yes, me drink from the fountain of the youth. <laughs> <laughs> He was referring to <laughs> I don't know the to fountain be honest, of youth. The fountain of youth, but, but I, I didn't said know you were referring to the youth. sperm. You were referring I to don't know. sperm. To I did not I have know not... that. <laughs> I, it's not funny. <laughs> and okay. to be honest, people, I said it so excitedly. Oh yes, I Cassidy, don't laugh. <laughs> I think he's remembering when I just said that. I was like, oh yes, I did from the fountain of youth. And I'm like, when I picked up that, I was, oh my, you know, people, you want to like take back something, you just can't take it back. Because oh, yes. I drink just, from the fountain of the youth. Yes, him just start laugh, laugh, <laughs> carrying on. And I was like, no. And he, of course, quickly ended the show because Cleo had no. Committed to admitting. Oh, boy. To you caught endorsing. me. No, I, I said me. it. I said it clearly. I thought you were referring to a biblical thing. Uh, that's what I thought. Well, we Something. don't know if that happens in the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know. Uh, oh, boy. Hey, but talk yours, about the yours Bible. is worse. Well, the time with the, with the with the candles, that one was crazy. Up earlier on you, in the year, you talked about trying to get romantic and, and lit the candles around the, the, the room, right? You remember that one? Yeah. And you got, how, how did you get the pillows to catch uh, on fire? What you do? No, you, I mean, you know... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you, you, you know when you uh, get your groove on and you create an, an environmental effect, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> environmental effect with you. You know, and... <laughs> you burn the place you down. Know, you get some candles, you know, them nice scented candles, and you just line them around the bed oh for, my for make the woman feel nice, and she come to the room, and the room Ooh. smell good and everything, you know. Fresh out of the shower, mm -hmm. all those things that you have on your nice, you know, nice little cologne and everything, and... She's wowed. <laughs> so now why I go through and you massage down and everything and you're ready for getting out the groove and you do certain things. You know, sometimes you do certain things and the pillar just in your way. <laughs> People may just throw the pillar off of the bed with excitement, you know, straight up forget to the meat and the matter. <laughs> to deal with the thing proper. I <laughs> see the room bright up, people. The room look at bright. Illumination. I <laughs> said, John, know so them can't go bad. When we look the pillar catch a fire. <laughs> I said, if you look at your fire, people. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Oh, my God. I have to take out the fire, take out the pillar, you know, people, with the fire burn. Oh, my God. I'm going to run when I barge with the pillar. You know, oh, one of the weakest things. You know, you know when things are burn. <laughs> Sit and drop off. Yeah, I. drop off, yeah. I tap on that. <laughs> I'm going to fling a pillar in the shower. 
turn on the shower. Oh. Boy, I tell you the truth. I first me put kangaroo on bed. Oh my goodness. Never again in a female oh. life. Me, me, me just stick to the regular. Boop, 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 oh, boop, boop. Jesus. And that's it for me. Oh, Ladies boy. and germs, it's now 9.30. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to a break. <laughs> Very the, time, moment. the time is brought to you by VJ Printing Services. <laughs> Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage. <laughs> <laughs> Native Audio Stage Lighted. <laughs> so <okay>. forward. <laughs> Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8932266 New Beginning Entertainment present New Year's Resolution Fun Day and Dance Monday January 1st at the New Beginning Entertainment and Shopping Center Eric Yasso St. Thomas bounce about ice cream fun activities for the kids so roll them out early in the day Juggling by Zone Warrior, Black Phenom, Tender Touch, Lake of Cheaps, a drink responsibly. Sanjari, are you ready? Crypto promotion brings to you. Bucket, glorious celebration. Place to be. Buccaneers, Jerk Center, St. Mary. And you don't know what this Sunday, December 31st. Oh, remember, free rides for the kids all day, all night. Admission 500, kids free. Plus, food and refreshments on sale. Come on and be entertained. All are invited. Must be 18 years and older to drink. Drink the sponsor big Bucket's New Year's celebration. It's going to be a blast. Bucket! St. Mary, we can't miss it. Boston Beach Complex presents Aquatic Rush, the seven-day party series from December 26th through to January 1, 2018. Every day's a beach party. Bring the entire family. Lots of fun, lots of excitement, lots of giveaways. DJ Flair, DJ Mookie, DJ Sheppy, DJ Shaka Fame, and so much more. Music by Les 5000, Amazon International, and different strokes. Don't you miss it. Aquatic Rush, the second edition. Seven days of party on Boston Beach. you got to reach. This is Jatty, the Reggae Ambassador. Join me this and every Saturday from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. Right here in Styles FM 961, 965, 967 for the Tony Lauren Show in style on style. We're gonna eat you off that G spot at 3 o'clock. We've got the collector's edition with Twin Spin. Inside Music Base with Teddy Ledley. Nuff, nuff, niceness. Right here in Styles FM. This and every Saturday from 1 p.m. until 5 p.m. You got it? Babes, calm down, calm down. A simple something this is fix. The hurt. Make we call solar options. The yeah, Queen Street Mart, they, they can fix all the highlight bill problems. Solar options? That sounds like a real plan. Get power from the sun. Solar options and Electroworks Limited. Located at 8 Queen Street, Mart Bay, St. Thomas. Contact us at 982-2910. Solar options. P power from the sun. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guess what? Styles FM has a new business number for you to call, text, and now WhatsApp. 518-2399. To advertise your business and events, call, text, or WhatsApp us on 518-2399. 518-2399. Don't forget, 518-2399. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, now offering stage lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, play, wedding, street party, or even club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, proud sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Delrose Green and Rel Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. 
Yep. Welcome back to Real Talk. And if, of course, in case you're just joining us, we want to say welcome to the show. It's the last show for 2017. But of course, we're glad you are on board with us and good to have you. And please stick and stay with Styles FM and, of course, keep it locked always to Real Talk every Friday night, 9 to 12 midnight. Yeah? All right, so to give you those numbers to hook us up, as we go throughout the show, remember, feel free to call us or text us on WhatsApp or a regular text message, SMS, right? Um, on this number, 4531444. That's 4531444. And, of course, if you wish to call us from overseas... That number is 954-338-7973. That's 954-338-7973. And we do have some numbers in the USA on the go, Canada, as well as the UK. If you are in the USA, that on the go number that you can listen is um, 712-832-2772. In the UK, it's 033001033322. And in Canada, it's 6479579637. And of course, we're not going to be leaving out our people on the social media sites. You know that you keep this show going as well, right? And from time to time, we get pictures, little clips of people sitting down, eating, relaxing, chillaxing, and just watching Real Talk with the one and a half crazy persons, yeah? So, social media peeps, you're large and in charge every time, all right? YouTube, of course, you can check out the post show. Go to Styles FM Radio. You can follow us on Instagram at Styles FM. On Twitter, it's Styles FM 961. And you can check out Facebook and look at Styles FM 961. Go to six, nine, Styles FM 961 and check out the fan page, all right? Or friends also in Brooklyn, Bronx. Yeah, we want to say big ups, big ups. And thank you guys so much for tuning in. Of course, in Brooklyn, it's 91.3 on the FM. And in Bronx, it's 102.9 FM. Monday, Sundays, Mondays, Tuesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. All right? Keep it locked every time. So as we go throughout the show, now I'm going to be highlighting my peeps who always, who are always with us. So Kevin in Tampa, Florida. Yeah, big ups. Carlene in New York. Tommy, I think this is a new one for me. Tommy in Claremont. Yeah. Checking in, radio, turn up. Pick up yourself, Tommy, every time. Marie, that's one of our newest um, persons, right? Am I right? Marie Cassidy? Marie, hey. No, that's, no? that's Cooley Road. Cooley Road, oh, okay. That's the only way him can create fireworks. Can I tell you, Marie? Can I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> and Claremont. Claremont is what, in Florida? Um, I think so. I, that looks like a Jamaican. I don't know if that's Jamaican Claremont. Mm, maybe. Maybe not. That's a, Jamaica, I think that's a Jamaican Claremont. Okay. Claremont in uh, St. Somewhere. Oh, Lord. St. Something. Claremont, St. Anne. Yeah. I yeah. Think. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Claremont, yeah, Claremont Saint Saint Anne, in St. Right. Anne for sure. Um, Kivoy, Sunny Hill, St. Thomas says, um, of course, good vibes. And he's, he's Mr. Chambers. Pick up yourself, Mr. Chambers. And Carlene, of course. He's confirming it's in St. Anne. Yes, St. Anne confirmation. Thank you very much, darling. Mm -hmm. So as you send your messages in, you know, shout out to you tonight, all right? Because I don't remember all the names, but and I want to big you up every time. Heal up the people. I mean, St. Thomas uh, that turned up at the outside broadcast last evening. Mm-hmm. Yep, so, you know, it was And if I didn't fun. know what I come in here, but I never know early enough. Only I tell my people them, because people from St. Thomas calling me to ask me, if you're coming, you're going to be there? And I never know, so. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Leave that part alone, please. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And big ups to, yes, all the St. Thomas people, yes, man, and my special, special farm, Billy. Yeah. By extension and immediate. Yes, man. Big ups, big ups to you. Miss Vera. Yes, up there at Clooney Road. 
Um, Murray, Bridgen, Bridgen, Bridgen. What's up, Copy? Yeah, and of course, we have um, Gary, picture frame, locked in from the other day. Big ups to you as well. And to my brother, Nell, who is locked in. Mommy, Janet, Uncle Barry, them just have the thing locked up there and playing stars like, whoa. Yeah, big ups, guys. Love you so much. All Don't right? forget Javine. Oh, we can't leave out. Oh, crazy. The man from Africa, right? Yes. Yes. He's he, from yes he's 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 the one from africa from africa okay yes. i hope he's doing good he says uh me always i hear who and uh, who locked in i mean never can hear my name yet so the boy Devin, you're here yes mm -hmm. <laughs> hey unufi glad say let me where am i say unufi glad say new year or tomorrow <laughs> or else hi <laughs> Oh boy, big ups to you as well. And of course, for the first time, I'm seeing Gary's picture up. Yes, up, up. I'm here listening. Big up yourself, Gary. It's a frame every time. All right. And I of will... course, the white gate massive. Yes. Shut up. Big up yourself. All right. Oh, tell me something. Yes. Where you get that points there? It's been nice, 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 nice. Um, what have you? Neon green pants, you know. Nobody come find a fault with my pants tonight, you know. It's a real, real pants, you know. Real, Cassidy, don't look around yourself and me like that. Do <laughs> not look around you like you're wanting about my pants, too. You like it? It's a green, oh, okay. I'm green. Then I color blind. It's a, a neon can. green. That's more yellow, right, Cass? No, it's a neon green. No. For the people out there who are not color blind and can see the video, Come on. see that my pants is a neon green. People will only agree with you because they just want to agree with you. Neon is a difference, you know. Neon lights are different from regular lights. That's neon yellow. I'll work with neon yellow, but neon not neon green. Is my not, not neon green. <laughs> <laughs> so, right now, people, it has been a good, 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 good year for for um, styles. Mm -hmm. now, I mean, in terms of us, no, in Saint Thomas. Oh yes. Yeah. Great accomplishment. That, yeah. That that, that one, I think that was kind of warm and nice and easy, yes. you know. And we still have greater plans, same way. So we are work on a few things, and the reception has been good. Oh, extremely good! From the persons there, and we want next year now, which is just around the corner, for do a small event in Saint Thomas, mm -hmm. introduce them to the Styles family, and the big event now, July, the second uh, Saturday in July. I'm I'm in pain. <laughs> I'm in pain already. You know yeah. why? I have an idea oh, why. Oh, God. So the big event, the second Saturday <sighs> in July, St. Thomas people roll out. I can tell you, St. Thomas people have always been coming to this event for the past <laughs> two years. It's four years old. And I expect to have a greater, greater, greater involvement of St. Thomas people because I can tell you, ladies and germs, are one of the biggest events for hit Portland a year time. Gentlemen. I want to say a while ago. Germs. A germs, I say? <laughs> You're so accustomed to saying it. <laughs> You're so accustomed to saying it that all right. it comes no, out. No, but with all fairness, I don't know if the man gentle. <laughs> I don't know if the man oh, gentle. Oh, continue talking. Jesus. All right, la all right, all right, all right. ladies and plenty men. <laughs> right? <laughs> me, you know, oh, it, it's, it's an event that you don't want to miss. And from, from um, February, you're going to be hearing... We promote it for as early as February. You're gonna be hearing um, and a lot of music and how the guys um, play music and what fan fusion is like. And it's the name speaks for itself. Fan fusion meaning yep. that we're fusing all the fans, you know, of of Styles FM, persons from Saint Anne, Saint Mary, Portland, Saint Thomas. Yes, mixing and mingling. You know, you um, know? Saint Catherine. Meeting. Everyone from all over, overseas. Yeah. A lot of overseas people come to Fan Fusion a year time and with us, with us mingle. Yep. You know what I mean? So, me expect to see people roll out in them numbers. Normally we have like two or so bus of people are rolling from Saint Thomas. So we're looking about six bus, eight bus. Mm -hmm. You know. And it's clear we say buses. <laughs> <laughs> the bus them. The bus them. <laughs> right. So, you know, you, you'll get more information. And Carleen, we expect to see you in a Jamaica. Because I, I say tell NY. You. I say NY beside the name, New York. Mm -hmm. Right. 
so I'm expecting to see you at Fan Fusion. It's Definitely. the second Saturday every year in July. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Which we start planning that already. Oh, yeah. I, I have some ideas, too. Are mm. you going to be here? I'm going to be here. Oh, you look like, but a, oh, you look like me, sir. Mm. Like a belly at you. Yeah. And I think about it. I got a wedding to do on that <laughs> day. It's the 14th. It's the 14th. Oh, I have a wedding all the way in Montego Bay. Well, we'll send the videos. I wonder if I can come back up. No. After the wedding. It's not. Not what? I don't. I mean, it all depends on what kind of wedding ends. Yeah. And it's going to be one real classy wedding, you know, so that might not end till all morning. Well, all right. <laughs> we'll tell you about it. Because sure, fun children don't normally end till morning. Mm -hmm, hmm. Can but, you sponsor me a trip? Daddy Rude, laugh out loud. <laughs> Caroline, Caroline is very, very, very ambitious. I like that. <sighs> I'm thinking about it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm actually thinking about it. So, um, tonight we're going to have a fun field show, as usual. And we're going to be doing some reflections. Oh, yes. And see what's going to happen or we're going to make. Well, we, we won't be doing any. What is something named resolution? Oh, no. No, we have, we have never done resolutions. Not really, but... You know, I've never, I've, I, I don't think I've ever done... I don't remember... Uh, Cass, did you ever do any New Year's resolution? And actually stick to it? Mm, we start out, but we ain't finishing. I think uh -huh. one time... I think, I think I've done a New Year's resolution once. And it was about if the next year I'm going to stop because bad And that never really <laughs> worked out. <laughs> you know, <it's, laughs> it Let never, me see. It, it never I'm worked out. I'm some things this year. I'm... I think they're going to be resolving some things, for sure, and sticking to them. <laughs> Look, I me, need me to. Have some, me have some old habits that I mean, I think are going to really work out well, hmm. trying to get rid of. I kind of like them, too. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like Daddy Rude, can I tell you? <laughs> you know, that part, oh, are we? But tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we have a really lovely box pop. And um, we're going to go into the box pop question right now. Mm -hmm. And just and before we do I, that. I crave your indulgence. Indulgence. Please, People, feel free. You know, please call in WhatsApp. Let us know and we're going to read your response to this box pop. Or yep. play your response or answer the phone call. Listen to your response to mm -hmm. this question. Remember the number to call us locally and to WhatsApp and to text is 4531444. All right, and overseas is 954-338-7973. Big ups to Hoppy and Kevin from Stony Hill. Big ups, all right. Okay, so our box pop for tonight. Out with the old and in with the new. Looking back at 2017, what are some of the highlights that you would consider to have impacted you in a positive or negative? negative way was 2017 a good or bad relationship year for you and of course what made it so all right so in retrospect you want to look at what were the highlights i guess highlights could be bad or good right yep or were the highlights um the things that you would consider you know a highlight moment for you that have impacted your life in a positive or a negative way what are the things that have happened that really took its toll on you in a good way or a bad way? Yeah? And, of course, was it a good relationship year for you or was it a bad relationship year for you? And if it was good, ooh, what made it so good? And if it was awful, who or what made it so awful? Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Very interesting one. Yeah. It's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Highlights. Highlight. I'm going to have to think a little bit more about the highlights. I had some negative moments, I can tell you that. Or is it that we normally remember the negative? Negative. They're easier to remember, right? And yes. they're probably more painful. Mm. But, but, yes, I could say that there were some positive ones to the latter quarter of the year, I would think. Okay. Very positive. Yes. Very positive. But have a, to have, the you middle, have a, you have a kind of like a smile on your face when you answer that part. Yes, to the middle of the year, they're about midway. Oh my God, tumultuous. What that mean? Tumultuous. 
Oh. Mm-hmm. I saw that multiplying and plus. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> the multiplying and plusing <laughs> went on there. Yes. So it was a bit rocky and, you know, some rough patches. Um, midway, uh, third quarter. Oh, Lord. Third quarter of the year. Yep. Yeah. And um, first part wasn't so bad. But from the midway, midway. What's the mindset? Look at your vig. It's like how oh, I can tell you something, something will happen to me. Enough. I can't remember all of them, and some of them are not fit for airplay. <laughs> you, you, uh, trust me. You know how to paraphrase. You've done quite well over the years. Um, I'm most of the negatives I can't remember. Oh, Lord. Dad, the things, them, make me know your business. Mm, I had a rough... I have... No, sir. I'm not ready for talk it. Cass, <laughs> 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 it don't look good for him. It <laughs> don't look good at all. Cass, <laughs> it looks like so clear. No, all right. No, no, um, I'm clear in the year. Health-wise, yeah. Health-wise, I've, I don't know. I'm concerned about this migraine man. But it's not so bad like last year. You man, it have a time bad man. Terrible migraines, man. You wonder if my head is going to lift off and just put on one different head. Yeah, but that has been like no, ugh, a nightmare for me. That has been like a little nightmare throughout the year, I must say. I must give thanks, though, that I'm in my sound mind, unlike my co-host, <laughs> and despite the, those migraines, and I've not been hospitalized, thank God for that, God be the glory, and I have still been able to laugh and just live and have fun. Despite those it's a setback days and moments, you know, and as we speak, I do have one. A migraine? Yeah, man. Real, real, oh, like a pain in the you know where. No. Yeah. <laughs> but that, that's one of the things that I can, that jumped out at me right readily and negative in a negative kind of way. Yeah. And as we go throughout the show, I'll remember other stuff, so I'll tell you. But can you think of one that was positive or negative? Well, um, one of the, the positive things I mentioned earlier, the Stars FM expansion mm-hmm. to St. Thomas. I mean, we've been a part of St. Thomas, but now we're more and more and more mm-hmm. in St. Thomas. And the, one of the other things is that we, well, let's not talk about we, me then, mm-hmm. right? Um, what a lot of persons don't know is that I used to live in St. Thomas for about seven years in Port Morant mm-hmm. until May of this year. So it's a positive and a negative yeah. right there. So because, you know, you get used to a certain lifestyle. And people, so, friends and, and stuff. Exactly. Yeah. And um, I'm now living at home, home with wife, family, wife, kid, right, in, in St. James. So now I have to learn how to live with a woman because... <laughs> <laughs> Come on, oh it's seven years. I live by myself. I go home for a weekend and things don't look so right. My back's on my mirror. I say, boy, God, do make Sunday my case and come. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't do that. <laughs> you stick with it, brother. Yep. So, um, that, that's one of the things. I miss a whole heap of people. You know, a whole heap of friends. I miss, really miss them. Because after a while, you know, you, you get older, you know, really. That we are called now bandy bandy. Mm-hmm. You know, you said no people say boy all of them friends is, is up to twenty something. Everybody else after this probably acquaintances and blah, but I really met some nice people in St. Thomas. And yeah, as you mentioned that, something just jumped at me. Mm-hmm. Um I too have met some really interesting people throughout this year. Um, in particular one person in particular, Diane, and her I haven't met all her kids as yet. I've met um De- um, Diana, um, or Diana, I don't remember which one the pronunciations, but she is a tower of strength and a really, really great, great girl. Yeah? Cool. So she's in Atlanta, Georgia. And of course, we, I did some work for her some time back. And we've just built a really, really cool, cool friendship. Yeah? Nice, nice. Yeah, nice. man. And I really look to her. I respect her so much. And I think that's one of the persons in your life that contributes significantly and meaningfully yeah and of course i have met some other friends even through the, the work that i do at stars yeah so vivian big ups big ups big ups 
Sivan as well, big ups. Uh, my friends who have been motivating and encouraging right throughout. Yeah, man, big ups. Cool. Yeah, man, big ups. Um, big up Andy, um, the taxi driver for Port Morant. Give thanks, road boy. The same, listen to the program. Cool. I mean, um, I, I, I miss you now. Hmm. Mm hmm. Negative? No, I mean, no, they are a whole for good still, you know. Whole for good. <laughs> no, I'm not really focused on the negative yet. Because I try, as I said, we said the negative would stand out more. Right? Uh, negative, negative. Well, one of the positives is that um, last, this year's fan fusion has been the best fan fusion. Oh, cool. And right? I was there. And you were Yay. there. Yay. It right, has been the best fan fusion, and I'm hoping that persons can come. We, are, we always say fan fusion is not an event, it's an experience. Yeah. So I want persons to look out for fan fusion 2018 to get the experience mm -hmm. of this event. Um, oh, how could I leave out Vanilla? <clears throat> yeah, Vanilla over there in Manhattan. Big ups, Vanilla. I, 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 she's one of the persons too who is a stalwart. Mm -hmm. Yes, a very, very dear, motivating, and very positive girl. Really love that. All yes, right? Big up nice. yourself, Mrs. Sinclair, and the family over there in Manhattan. All right? Cooler, cooler, mm -hmm. cooler, cooler, cooler. And, um... Hmm. Well, one negative mm -hmm. is that for this year, uh, we've lost oh. three family members. My uncle... Oh, wow. And about a week after he passed, his sister died. Mm -hmm, I remember that. And then in November, I think my grandma died. Mm -hmm. So, hey, kids, kids really say, say the darnest thing. Oh, they do. So my daughter's supposed to read some scripture thing at the funeral, right? It, which, is, which is next week. Mm -hmm. She had practiced this morning. And the last line was something about, about, about fear in God. Mm -hmm. I said, Mommy, can you please look this over? Because it can't be right. <laughs> something that right about it. She said, what, what is that? Oh, Lord. God is not the devil. Why should we fear God? <laughs> <laughs> this can't be right. In a sense. Oh, man. <laughs> this can't be right. <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, oh people, people, we are taught to be God-fearing. Yes. But the kids not seeing it seen that, that way. That you know, say, boy, why are you afraid of something we're supposed to? We're yeah, supposed to be good to you. Right. But, um, so much things. Oh, one of my brethren, good brethren, <coughs> when name, when name, um, Unicorn, he's a recording artist. Mm -hmm. He was killed in oh. November, I think. Mm. He was killed in November. Um, he, he did a song, Dead Wine. Mm -hmm. Give me the dead wine, dead wine. And also, he also did the one about Oko Pepila and Ting Bome with, with um, mm -hmm. what's her name, Maka Diamond. Maka, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So he, he was killed um, sometime, I think it is in November. Mm -hmm. and, last month, and I think so. As you said that, I just um, can't help. I, I wanted to do it from the opening. Uh, I kind of kind of slipped me. I must say condolence to all the Jamaicans who have, you know, well, experienced or is feeling the loss of our fellow countryman or child in the fire in New York. Mr. Man. Yes, it's really, really heart-wrenching. I think it's about five Jamaicans, they say. Something like that. Something like that. And I think most of them were kids, like about three of the lot mm -mm. were Jamaican. Well, you know, Jamaicans, they live there for a while, but they are Jamaicans. True. And Jamaicans are not. We really, really, our hearts really go out to the family members who have lost their loved ones in such a very, very awfully tragic kind of way. Um, we just want to implore to parents, please remember that it is your utmost responsibility to monitor the kids. Don't leave them unattended worse when you know some of them are finger fearing and stuff. Watch the kids and ensure well, that they don't well, be. Well, you know, what is a finger fearing? What do you mean? I mean, I mean teeth, but. <laughs> 
mean then touch his man. Oh, and no, no. But if I ask him, what you not mean, man? <laughs> ask him, what you mean? <laughs> you know what? Right, them hands build the man, and them just <laughs> what you mean? play with this, and go play with that, and, you know, watch them and make sure. We can't check you, you know. Ouch. Watch them and monitor, it, monitor them so much that, you know, they yes. don't, these tragic things yes. don't occur. Clear those call the people them <laughs> neatly. <laughs> <laughs> you know <laughs> Okay, I'll stand you. Being <laughs> <Because laughs> fair, it means the, um, oh stealing, but it's not only that it mean. What? No, it mean yes. touches, touches. Yes, from your grow. What finger fear means, sir? No one, some finger fear means. But let's steal the matches and go play yes. with it. I see him. No one, some finger fear means. You know what? This person said they love this show. And guess what? I love you right back, honey, for loving the show, all right? I'm going to get rid of my co host now. Thank God for the break. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, right? it's now one minute after 10. Oh, boy. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> the time is brought to you by VJ Printing Services hmm, and Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio and Stage Equipment Service. We're so forward. Mm, sure. <laughs> are you ready? Crypto promotion brings to you Bucket Fury Celebration. Place to be Buccaneers Jerk Center, St. Mary. And you don't know what this Sunday, December 31st. Oh, remember, free rice for the kids all day, all night. Admission 500, kids free. Lots of food and refreshments on sale. Come out and be entertained. All are invited. Must be 18 years and older to drink. Drink a sponsor big Bucket's New Year's celebration. It's going to be a blast. Bucket! St. Mary, we can't miss it. Ladies and gentlemen, let's roll as the La Best family presents Pure Diamond Ball. The Errol Flint Marina Ignite can ride the airport Antonio Portland. New Year's night, Monday, January 1st, 2018. News by Digital T and DJ Gemini. Admission 500 pre sold, 1000 at the gate. Revelers, get ready. Thinking of a place, extraordinary place where you can get a wide variety of Jamaican cuisine, scrumptious local dishes, and at the most affordable price? Zilla's Kitchen has the widest menu to suit your appetite and lifestyle. We're located at Bridge Street, Port Antonio. Place your order for pickup or delivery service. Call us at 453-6030. That's 453-6030. Zilla's Kitchen, the restaurant of choice. We never close. We never close. Good day, driver. You notice that you're parking in a no parking zone. You know, so you can get a ticket for this, sir. Really, officer? But just want to pick up some hardware supplies, you know. Do me a beg you. Give me a blind, huh? So if you need hardware supplies, why you don't go to Ramtula Supercenter and Hardware? Ramtula Supercenter and Hardware, 34 Folly Road, Port Antonio, Portland. We stock a wide range of products at the best prices in town. At Ramtula's Hardware, experience the three C's. Comfort, competitive prices, and convenience. Ramtula Supercenter and hardware opens 8 a.m. to midnight seven days per week call 715-5132 email ramtulasupercenter at gmail.com remember we have the best prices in town no space the body where you are push it on me you don't know this is Craig T. Now we're representing for the Adrenaline Rush with a musical ingenious digital T. Saturdays right here on Styles FM. You don't know. 48 to make the date and don't be late. You understand? Because the new artists and new music segment is from 5 to 6. So make sure you're there and the girls there. I feel in my bone up the place. It's not left no space. Don't miss it. Do you have or are you seeking a place to rent, seeking employment or have a job vacancy? Are you selling a car or having a garage sale? Then come see us. Let Styles do the advertising for you and you'll be on your way in no time. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Advertising Style. Advertise with Styles. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, now offering stage lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, play, wedding, street party, or even club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, proud sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Delrose Green and Rail Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. 
Yep, welcome back to Real Talk on Styles FM, the radio station that the world listens to, all right? Yeah, so the Vox, what we're talking about now is, of course, out with the old and in with the new. You know, a new year is ringing in soon, right? So looking back at the 2017 year, what are some of the highlights that you would consider to have impacted your life in a positive or negative way? And was it a good relationship year for you? What made it so? So we were pretty much on the positives and negatives, the highlights, yeah? And of course, please feel free to share those highlights with us if you so desire. I mean, mm -hmm. when it comes to relationship, I can't really talk upon that cause, you know, as a married man and thing. You know what I mean? I have nothing negative to say about that, mm. you know? Mm. But one positive though, from a day to me, yesterday I forced my cook. <laughs> <laughs> yesterday. Is that positive or negative? A positive that man. Miss J have belly ache? No man. I'm more more. No man, you're mad. Just checking. No, nah, listen. It is it is a known fact. Mm-hmm. That you are a fact. cooker. Say, yeah, when it comes to the kitchen, I mean run that oh. just, just just make sure say your you make sure say your belly full before me start cook. Because if you're ever hungry, I'm a cook. <laughs> Dog when you am you, cause you're oh, dead. Oh Lord. Me take long oh, to cook. Jesus. Me one of them. I don't know how people cook fast, mm -hmm. but me one of them smarter the way, really and truly. I cook fast. Spend a lot cook, of time. And 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 I cook to taste. If I think about it, and to me, in my mind, say, oh, <coughs> this with this going taste good. Oh. We put it together. Mm. And it it you usually. You couldn't cook for a living then. You're dead. You're dead for hungry. Yeah. <laughs> no yeah. pun intended. Would I did that with a killer for people because me don't make up for people dead for hungry straight up. Me can't run restaurants and all them so, No. Maybe maybe one of them restaurants, you know when you sit down and you have to, them them up them out for you and with something name, something for drink first and the drink get get hot cause the ice belt out tonight too and it get hot and the food I prepare you one day. Yeah. Them type of restaurant they make it hmm. work. I, another okay. Another highlight that comes to mind is I love learning new things, very open to that, and I have had the privilege of meeting. No nah, man, tell me what you learn, man. You're too man. vague, man. Listen, let me finish. You're too vague, because I know I all on the one who wish part of my belly, they cut me and wish part of my I do it, I do it now. Finish. Oh, goodness. <laughs> um, I'm going to tell you now. In, in, in the capacity of MC, yeah. I've had the privilege of really growing. Yeah. Learning more as I grow and um, being exposed to the world out there, which is sometimes very, very challenging and demotivating, if you ask me. But, yeah, I've learned a lot from the persons I've encountered, both good and bad. And I've also gained experience and exposure, which I think can be only be a plus if for someone who's aspiring to do what I do. So, yeah. It's been good. You're too vague, man. That's clear. As Crystal, I have learned through the opportunities that I've gotten to go out and MC. Like where? Okay. I did a tasty thingy some time ago, earlier up in the year. I did an OB at, um, was it pe the Petals variety there? Yeah. Um, I've done work with the, par with the municipal council. I've done work with Sun Life Corporation. I can't remember all of them. And there are more to the come. The jerk something. What was this again? The jerk something. I don't remember that one. There's so many of them. <laughs> Which jerk something? <laughs> oh, the pan chicken. The pan chicken experience. That was... That's what I thought about. Oh, and another highlight for me. I met one of my favorite... My... Two, two of them I love, but he's one of my favorite. He's one of the favorites. Um, Agent Sasko, oh yes, I had the privilege of meeting and chit chatting with him and interviewing him. So that was a little plus for me, yeah. And the next one you need to bring on stream me. is a busy, busy. <laughs> I love me my busy signal. Okay, I'll, beep, I'll, beep, I'll, I'll beep, call you and yeah. have a call. <laughs> yes, yeah, so that was a little plus for me right there. Um, so all these experiences, and I've done weddings, um, you know, so really kudos. And, and through Styles as well, I have gotten some offers, so really cool. Nice, yeah. nice, nice. Ladies and gents, 
Ladies and gentlemen, I'll say, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, Lady Cleo is a good MC. I can tell you, she turned idiot when Thank she you. she turned idiot <laughs> when she <laughs> MC. She gets in a, she gets in an element that is not that is not what that is not befitting <laughs> of how she looks. <laughs> Oh, so Lord. she's a very good MC. Yeah. Let's 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 <laughs> see you, you let's let's see what Finery has to say from Port Morant. All right. Finery 2017 Relay for Life. It was amazing and it showcased that cancer is not the end of your life and to keep fighting and live life. Thank you so much, Finery. Thanks for that motivation. Really? And to all the cancer pa patients out there, those who have overcome, those who are battling, keep the fight going, people, all right? Yeah. Um, let's see what Carlene Carlene says here. Um, not all parents are parents and know how to parent. That's true. Some of them only pay the rent. Yeah. Mm. Parenting is not about just having a child or children. If they, it's their responsibility to play the parenting roles. Whenever people have children or a child, a child or children, they need to be more vigilant and observant. Some parents take everything for a joke and don't realize how risky and dangerous what their kids are doing. True I that. can't say my highlights on the air. All right, not a prob. Thanks, though, for the comment as it relates to children because that's a real talk, big and serious. Real thing, real thing, real yeah. thing, real thing. Carla, big up yourself, girl. Big up every time. Carla out of May Pen. Yep. So, I mean, for me, I remember one of the time I drive up. I was well hungry. Mm -hmm. I missed up at a certain restaurant where everybody liked to eat. Where they give you only one dege dege ketchup. I mean, I call on him. <laughs> right? One dege dege ketchup then give you. Right? Mm-hmm. I oh, reach a certain distance, certain things start act up on me. <laughs> <laughs> People. Oh my goodness. <laughs> reach a certain distance, certain things start <laughs> act up on me. I say, boy, Jano star. Everything smooth Come and jiggy. Man. Yeah, man. Everything smooth and jiggy. I'll make it. This is on Friday when I when roll up for real talk. Oh, Lord. Mm. So. Mm -mm. Never make it. Mm -mm. Roadside. <laughs> ah, street one side, I'm a base. That one near roadside, <laughs> people. When I grow on and talk. And it's a good ah, thing, say. Thank God for the year end. God for the soil. And it's a good thing, say. I, uh, um, at, at, at dusk. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> at dusk. Yo. I roll up close to Port Maria, I tell you straight up, and I decide say, if I ever <laughs> go to Port Maria town, a problem for me. <laughs> Why? Oh, Lord. I tell you how it go still. How we know why, I tell you how it go. But, oh, not nah, close oh. highway was the byway. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Deliverance, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> and I grow up. No. Oh, Carl, I'm gonna know where you talk. We can't go for a year now. Carlin, I know you know. Mr. Sorry for you, Carlin. Trust me. We don't know what go, can't go for a year now, people. Oh but boy. We know so that of a paraphrase, the neatest way. Big ups to so, Andy in Port Marant, listening and so, enjoying the program. Kudos the, to you, Andy. The highlight <laughs> to that <laughs> is that we never reach the town. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we, have a, we have a caller on the 453. Good night, caller. Welcome to the show. Hello, good night. How are you, sir? I am here. I am here. You. Good to have you visiting with us. Yeah, yeah I, I, am, I am here, and I am listening to you on my radio in the car. Okay, and what's your highlight Hello. tonight? Tell us. Yeah. Well, tonight is a crazy night. I heard that Daddy Road was eating here. <laughs> yes, <laughs> from the from the goat. The goat, yeah. From the goat meat, yes. Oh my God, Daddy Road, you sh you should not have started eating back the goat meat. <laughs> <laughs> and you see the teeth, the teeth was the goat laughing at you, say. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That is so right. <laughs> so, the twenty eighteen. 
the 2018, no eating of the goat. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Is it 2018 is all you have to go? Oh Lord. No, no, no more eating of the goat. No, no more eating, eating of the goat, the goat indeed. <laughs> no, but I no more goat party. No more goat. <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> but, <laughs> hey, both have sitting against me, road boy. Kill me dead, they have sitting against me. <laughs> <laughs> we wanna know though your highlights, good and bad for twenty seventeen. The good and bad for twenty seventeen. Yes. Well the good the good about twenty seventeen is that I found a good group of guys that we started a, a CTC production team, and that is the good highlight for us. Nice, okay. nice. So the, the, the bad, the bad, the only bad is that I lost too much family members. Oh. Is I lost, I lost at least ten family members from me. What? Where are they? Yes, I, I am, I am one of the people that don't really talk about it so much, but. That is the bad of the 2017. I don't mm. want nobody to go in the 2018, but I am not God. Mm. Yes. Jano. Oh, well, yeah, you're still stronger for it, yeah? Yes, yes, yes. All righty. Thank you so much, right. boy. Okay. Keep it locked. Faithful All listener, right. can I tell you? All right. Um, All right. Respect, respect. Show. Respects tall up, tall up, tall up. And trust me, he promotes stars, like seriously true, promotes true, the true. show and the station. All right? Thumbs up to our friend Devoy. Yes. Highlights 2017 for you. Mm-hmm. We had a good year for work. Oh, good yeah. year for work. Hmm. Couple yeah. Couple Gain a couple pounds. People are here. <laughs> Gain a couple pounds. All right, so highlights for me. Work wise, it was good. Been a couple of places out of town that I've never been before. Yeah. Um, I'll leave it like that. Okay. With the pounds? <laughs> oh, the weight, the, the, the weight when put on? The pounds. Yeah, um, the pounds when put on. <laughs> stress. Stress. Stress pounds. Oh, I hear you. Yeah, people yeah, say. I just leave it like pe that. People okay. say stress. stress um, some persons put on, put on weight when yeah. they stress out. So hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the fuck am I the new girl, relationship wise, um, ish, ish, ish. I see. new any new girls, ish, <laughs> <laughs> ish. You know the parade so. You miss any old girl? No. Blah! Ra 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 ra. Wait up! Don't don't listen to this mix up man here. Don't make him dry you out. All right, okay. and that we are talking about. Don't make him you that out. we are talking about. New foods out with the old. In with them. In with the new. And that we are talking about. <laughs> Me can't now say you so. get Cassidy into trouble. Thank you, Carla. For choo, choo, choo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Carleen says, It's been a very rocky road, but I give thanks to God, my Heavenly Father, for the good things that happened and continue to happen. Grateful for families and to the few real and genuine friends that stood by me in my very down days when it seems like there was no other way and there is no light at the end of the tunnel. Big up, Carla. Carlene, rather. Carlene. Yes. And keep the positive vibe, girl. I love it. True, Positive true, energy true. is always good. Hey. Oh, oh my God, paraphrase, I want to know. Oh, Lord. Let me give you some time to think about that while I say I know me, hold that on. I, I completed... I, hold on. Yes? I completed um, events management. Events planning course. Mm -hmm. Yes. You, co you copy? No, I didn't copy. Then I just wrote and I wrote in the exam and I just wrote. And you then never I heard a voice say, okay, you can stop writing now. You never ace yeah. it then, man. Look here, man, we pass with flying colors. We and of course, easy. big ups to my team members. The you, never four want, of us you never want ace it. Who really just put on a fine so, show out in the town square. You never or try open cheat. Day, you will open day. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yes. You never try to cheat. No. Why not? Cheating is not a part of Cleo. No, but I didn't, why, why didn't you? Why would you? I cheat on an no, exam? No, why? I studied. You I know, worked hard. No, listen, me have exam. Hey, Cassidy, me have tests when me used to do when me go to high school. Bio. Me couldn't do bio good. Well, whenever me study bio, me fail. When me not study, me pass. <laughs> you can't explain that, rude boy. Well, when me study, me feel when me not study, me pass. You know, I'm a pass. When you go school, when you me not study, one question, yes, or the one they go, number one. But not that when me not study, not me copy one. off a Veran book. 
and you call Verena pass, me must pass. When me study, me try to do it myself and fail. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, the teacher never recommend me for do for do bio. <laughs> oh Jesus, you wonder why, huh? All right, Carla says met new meet new friends and found the best radio station ever. Looking forward to 2018. Wow! Oh, give thanks, give thanks, give Carla, thanks, Carla. Because give yourself thanks. every time, cool. Give All thanks, right. Carla. And of course, hey, do we Aldo, have? Aldo, Aldo, I every week Carla like me, you know. <laughs> Why do you always have belly and stomach problems? Him <laughs> niam too much. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, no, easy. no, listen, listen. No, no, no. I'm a processing plant. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> We're like the scientific name. That's called that's called a scientific name, people. A processing <laughs> plant. <laughs> oh, a very yummy, yummy yeah. processing plant. No, huh? Some people are warehouse. Oh, some people, some people are warehouse, you know. Oh, but I'm a processing Jesus. plant. Cassidy, are you a warehouse? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cleo, you look like a warehouse. I'm a processing plant too. <laughs> 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 you know, I swear to God. Cassidy, you have some people on two, three days in the road, boy. Oh. Two, three days. Uh, Carla says Cassidy is my problem. Okay, okay. Oh, re. <laughs> <laughs> He's he more no way him do here. Oh boy! But I mean, <coughs> when 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 you, when you look back on the year in 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 its entirety, not necessarily affecting you personally, but or directly it can have an indirect effect, which is the whole crime and violence issue, mm-hmm. right? And boy, I might tell you say, me no know, me, me really and truly no know what go on. But it thing get a little bit, it, it it just get blatant and yeah. things can be a lot much much it's much surreal. much much better. It's yeah. actually surreal. You're wondering if it's the, actually these things are actually happening. Yeah. Or you're watching a movie the, or the, something. The explanation behind it and some of the time is just it's just trivial issues where mm-hmm. back in the days you could have, you could have spans off one face and raise some of the rat and mm-hmm. you know what I mean kick off some of the foot off a grung and then sitting there. No ideas, boy. I mean, I know. I don't. I, mean, I don't know, I don't if, know. if if we are seeing, and I say we <laughs> as a, as a nation, seeing the real seriousness of the effects of this thing, you know. The real thing. It's killing us as a nation, as a people. You I know, go, I go people tell losing their lives mo, just mo, recklessly, mo, man. Mo, mo, more people hear the party, you know. Statistics is showing that. I know. Listen, this Cassidy. Statistics is showing that the the birth rate in Jamaica has declined. Mm-hmm. So in the next couple of years, probably in the next 50 years, we'll have a, a, an, an aging society, mm-hmm. society because people are birthing less. Right. You know, back in days, a lady would have like all four, five, eight picnic. Mm-hmm. Nowadays, it's like one person, yeah. one child. Now, if by natural cause, we are heading towards becoming an aging society, mm-hmm. with the level of Murders, murders that's yeah. happening. It's gonna go faster. Exactly, and not just murders. You look, you, you look on other causes mm-hmm. of death. So murder is one factor. Then you have um, the, the traffic yeah. accidents oh, and them something. Oh, that yes. one next factor, which which is a, which is a major thing. And then you have the whole health risk, mm-hmm. the health hazards where surround all of us. Yeah. So I think maybe the projection might be m- much faster. Yeah. Than, than the amount of years they are saying. So we have looked into certain things, people, because you see, if we now <coughs> grow our population, because you see, our population has slowed down, you know. Yeah. The growth rate, and even from an economical standpoint, it's not going to look good for people. Mm-hmm. And, and then if you know, notice, so we're talking about certain and certain short people in the place, you know. I talk, show, I talk, yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> We talk to them about certain and certain things <laughs> whose population are increased. Mm-hmm. You have certain countries around this world where they have much you had millions of people. Right? I don't know wonder why certain migration are going. You have certain countries in this world where you have more man than woman. Mm-hmm. Right? 
Hey, I wonder why certain migration are going on. Watch what go on, people. May I tell you, if we are get older, because not for we, you know, as 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 family, we say, but we only we only want one pitney. Because a certain things now we don't want to be bogged down with parenting. Mm -hmm. So I only say, but I just want a one youth. When you get the one pitney now, career take over. But when you get old, and possibility your one youth might not want a youth. Exactly, because of probably the, the lifestyle that you had. Bob the Bob. lifestyle where you have name yeah. probably encouraging for them getting a youth neither. Right. And why well, I mean, I know if you're telling their people. It just it just mm, uh, it just uh, it just don't look pretty. Mm. You know what I mean? Well, Andy, I say. Andy says, I must say my year was good and bad. I lost my father on June 3rd. Mm -mm. Oh, my. Condolence to you, my dear. And your birthday on June 13th. And 13. my birthday was June 13th. Wow. Good is that I found a radio station that teach me a lot of things and let me meet new friends such as Carla in Maypen. Oh. Madly, madly, madly. Isn't that madly. tweet? Yep. Hmm. Madly. Yeah, styles moment. Yeah, man, and and the nearly met DJ ball today. Me about it. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <Aww. laughs> so. Winsome. Winsome in St. Thomas says, end of year shout out to all Styles family. Big up yourself, girl. From the beginning of the year to the ending. Your different programs is wonderful. From the new year from the new year coming. My peace and love. Mm. New Year continent. Peace Continue. And love. Okay, peace and love. Win some. Pear tree, Pear river. tree river. Pick yep. up yourself, win some. Madly. Yes. Yeah. Send Thomas peeps. And of course, oh, why are you consuming the wrong things? thing? No, you need to change for 2018. <laughs> no, <laughs> <laughs> hey, right now, people want to know. Say, I know for like a blend up and old shake and I said, them oh, man, man, I beat. I'm telling you, for over a year now, I'm not gonna eat certain meat. You see me so. I just a plant, Colleen. I just a plant here when I know where I was when I was store nothing. Well, I wonder if people have we have box pop. Box pop. Yeah. The persons for the yep. topic tonight. Let's let's hear, let's hear what the what street the is saying. saying. Well, in my view, 2017 was a good relationship um, experience for me because I am still with the same person for almost two years now. Um, I don't have regrets. So I wouldn't even say in with the old or to the new. I don't follow certain concepts again. So. Really, it's just forward thinking, positive thinking, as much as possible. Um, and it's a year, you know. 2017 was a, was not. It was a year of changes for me, but relationship-wise, it was good. Um, I just hope to make some money in this new year. That is my agenda now. That is on my agenda. The top of my list is to be financially stable. So outside everything else, I'm good. Come to think of it, um, I lost a very close friend recently. That was what ended 2017 for me. Yeah, I lost a friend to cancer. Um, and I moved from the parish that I was born in to a different parish. So that is somewhat of another change. Well, 2017, year 2017 for me was, um, was you know, it was mostly positive, a few negative along the way. You know, as usual, you know, family vacation is always important. 20, 30 of us can travel together, I go vacation, the same location, and, and hang on Lyme together. And, you know, one of, one of the more memorable moments for me was when we went to um, La Best Sports Bar for the first time, you know, karaoke night, Sunday night, digital tea pan, at the DJ, and, you know, karaoke was so fun so much fun you know you get to realize who can sing and who can sing and who not forgot back at karaoke again that was a memorable moment another memorable moment for us was when about 16 and my family family members of us we went to um to a, a, a very important event that we look forward to every year and we just enjoyed partying liming everybody a party dance and everything together it was so much fun let's just say fun fusion 2017 was more we were more than mixed intoxicated it was more than mixed intoxication it was a lot of fun and you know just enjoying the time here at Christmas time with family again and then taking time out from that time and just spending family time with the immediate family 
was so important so that's how 2017 would end you know as usual there's always a positive and negative you know we lost some family members along the way in 2017 which was uh, a negative for us a couple negatives for us and you know one of the major negative for me this year which really has me until now is the fact of learning that my mom you know has a serious illness which it's hard when you know one of the rock in your life is down and you look forward to that rock to be strong so you can learn to be strong too but you know we're just hoping with 2018 inside that there is hope and opportunities for her and you know it's it's been one of those years and it's been a year of, of family food fun fellowship for me and you know other family members also and you know we're looking forward to 2018 you know looking forward to 2018 and just just Enjoy, enjoying life and through it all to continue to learn in 2018 you know the importance of family friends food fellowship how to love live laugh and love and with good health and peace in 2018 real talk real talk indeed and of course the time is brought to us by vj printing services it's now 10 30 and real talk is sponsored by Native audio and stage equipment services. We'll soon be back. Don't go anywhere. Architects, draftsmen and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high quality white paper printing that is water resistant and never fades unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266 New Beginning Entertainment present New Year's Resolution Fun Day and Dance Monday, January 1st at the New Beginning Entertainment and Shopping Center Eric Yasso St. Thomas Bounce about ice cream Fun activities for the kids So roll them out early in the day Juggling by Zone Warrior, Black Venom, Tender Touch, Lake of Cheap, so drink responsibly. Send Jerry, are you ready? Crypto promotion brings to you. Bucket, glorious celebration. Place to be. Buccaneers Jerk Center, St. Mary. And you don't know what this Sunday, December 31st. Oh, remember, free rides for the kids all day, all night. Admission 500, kids free. Lots of food and refreshments on sale. Come out and be entertained. All are invited. Must be 18 years and older to drink. Drink the sponsor big Bucket's New Year's celebration. It's going to be a blast. Bucket! St. Mary, we can't miss it. Lady K, Kimmy Boo, Shaki Diva, in association with Rumba Roman Styles Affair, present a New Year's Bossy Monday and Bird Night Party. La Fang Wan, Monday, January 1st at the Triple K Nightclub, Stokes House, St. Thomas. Juggling by Galaxy Sound and DJ Mookie from Styles FM. Don't forget to drink responsibly. Cliffhanger Restaurant and Lounge says, cheers, let's ring in 2018. An all-white New Year's Eve party featuring Grammy-nominated international group Raging Fire. Acoustic show, Sunday, December 31st, 2017. It's an 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. event at the Cliffhanger Restaurant, Ross Craig, Long Bay, Portland. Admission, 25 U.S. dollars. Cocktails and orders included. Champagne at midnight. Part proceeds in aid of charity. For more information, call 435-9739 or 435-9759. And don't you worry, my people, don't you ever forget. DID Block Factory and Hardware presents their massive paint sale happening right now at all three locations. Up to 25% off some paints. Paints as low as $1,165. Can you believe it in this time? DID massive paint sale is on at all three locations. 7 Thompson Avenue Buffet, Main Street St. Margaret's Bay, and 44 William Street, Port Antonio. DID massive paint sale. Come now. On until December 31, the big paint sale. Your foundation starts with us. DIB Block Factory and Hardware.
the management and staff of Styles FM would like to pause and express our gratitude and appreciation to our advertisers, sponsors, and listeners for their loyalty and dedication towards our company. Here's to another year of harmonious and prosperous association as we look forward to serving you even better for 2018 and beyond. May the spirit of the season be with you. Wishing you a 2018 full of happiness and success. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, now offering stage lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, play, wedding, street party, or even club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio and Equipment Rental Services, proud sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and Rel Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Welcome back to Real Talk, peeps. And of course, um, <laughs> very, very, very interesting Vox spot we're looking at. You know, looking at the highlights, the positive and the negative highlights of your 2017. Please feel free to call us on 453 4 And you can WhatsApp us as well. WhatsApp text, that is. Um, us on that number as well, all right? And of course, overseas, it's 954-338-7973. Um, while we be hanging out for those calls, let me just say a special thank you to our dear friend, Dan Dan, my radio frenemy, yes, <laughs> my real talk frenemy, who has been with us right throughout. I can anticipate a call more often than not from Dan Dan every single week. So True. big ups to you, Dan Dan. Thank you so much. Kevin, where is Kevin? Is in in Florida? Tampa? Tampa. Yes. There's also a trucker who normally calls. I don't know if it's the same Kevin, but somebody who's always driving the trucks okay. and stuff. Yeah. Big ups always locked in. DG, you have contributed so much to the show over the weeks. Can I tell you, girl? Huh. And of course, girl power every time. Yeah? Girl power every time. And of course, Shells, um, who has even held down some of the shows in Cleo's absence. Yeah, and of course, Prestige. Right, yeah. Oh, Lord, not to, not to mention, even in one category by himself. Big ups to Prestige and Shelly, yeah, who is always a part of us. And Bright, yeah, me, I tell you, boy. Yeah, it's too bright and dry some of the time, and then it just <laughs> lock up some of the time, and him nasty, and all these things. But of Where's course, where's the bright idol? I'm not seeing. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you say me can't talk patwa. Me talk patwa, you can ask me what me say. Okay. Patwa is yeah, yeah, nasty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so good. Not try. Not try. Do. Oh, Don't try. Point, right, yeah, you contributed so significantly to this show. You gave me some moments when I was in stitches. Oh, boy. And yeah, when he speaks the English, oh, boy, that's even funnier. But big ups to Bright Eye, yeah, to Gracie, to Miss B, to all our peeps, yeah? Yep. Remember, the phone lines are open, guys. Please, please feel free to text us or Le to Let me answer something. Because. You, you ever, all right, have you done anything that you're kind of sorry to so you do it? Like I saw you that want to for a long time, and you're sorry to so you do it. Eh? Mm. You want to share? Uh-huh, uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> May I share for me? Yesterday. Oh, Lord. You have, a little, you have a little bee for a long time, years upon 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 years. Upon years. Mm -hmm. Like after bee there. I don't know which brave film I'm going to take one day since here. I'm going to say, yo, I'm going to make a talk. Lord. I normally see my healing man and everything, you know. I'm going to come to boom and I see I'm going to come to and I say, I see if I still have it. <laughs> I'm going to make a talk, rude boy. I look at the talk cement, you know. But you know, you make a talk and you just people laugh and you go about your business. Left number and all these things. But you know, I call and you don't expect them to call. You know about three weeks pass and the phone go ring. You know me no answer. <laughs> <laughs> Cassidy. See it there. Me no answer Cassidy. Me get butterfly at the same time. Because me as a genuine star. Support a woman I mean business with me. Do. Because right now me live with moms. Right? Can't go on. Uh, me, me salt. <laughs> me salt. 
I want you to hear it long before me know mom's <laughs> sitting good on material now. I'm not going to flop out. <laughs> I make big doggy. Can't I'm going to make big speech and can't, can't live up. Can't I make a speech? <laughs> I make a speech, Cassidy. I say, my girl, let me tell you something. You know, if I want my love you off, you don't understand the type of love I love you off. I call her one name, which she never does. I say, if you're there with that you, then I love you. It hurt me. <laughs> No, you have to be hiding on a rock. <laughs> Yo, you have to be hiding yes, on a rock. <laughs> the last time she did there with it, it hurt me. It never hurt me still, you know. What the hell is it hurt me? Your lyrical song. Yeah, mom said, it hurt me, my girl. <laughs> and see the now you're the man left. It even hurt me more. <laughs> and see the... I'm there right now. I'm still in the line now, my girl. You know much man cut me. <laughs> cut the line. I'm a wait. Wait, I'm still waiting. Sorry, my co-host is an idiot. <laughs> she said, well, I know your part of kind of mash up like a bitch. She said, um, so aren't you married? I said, my girl, a one finger and a nine left. <laughs> <laughs> Cass, I said, when I done, I feel proud of myself. <laughs> I mean, you still I mean, got it. Eh? You still got it. Well, me never know till you call me. I don't know when you call me for a cast, but me not on my phone. Because <laughs> 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 I planned that speech there. I hear that speech there, Bill. <laughs> but me never have nothing more. <laughs> DJ4, pick up yourself madly every time. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I believe you still have it, Daddy Road. <laughs> oh, Carla, oh, I'm idiot. <laughs> Is it that him still have it or she have it at all? I'm a bit of an idiot. Buy that line. <laughs> only, only one finger nine no. left. Can you imagine? Yes. If you call me, no. I know if you answer, I say, come and build up something. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Jano. Oh, Lord, I tell you, boy. I'm a salt, you know. And I like one time. When you could have an anonymous vehicle, if my vehicle can't miss, so I can't pull over on the roadside. Oh, it, boy. Anytime people see my roadside, no, they, they must say, boy, well, I'm not road. Nobody has to stop me. The boy. And then see my vehicle pull on the roadside, eh? they must say, mm hmm, that road. They're up to something. Chano. Javine says, hey, may I go share mine too? Girl finally decided to send on. Yeah. And come link me. And man ready for kill, but a little smell start lurking. And brother, mm -hmm. me say, girl, take off. And me instantly ask her if she no smell herself. Mm -hmm. Girl said no. Me said, general. Me say, B, you got to go. You got to go. Got to go. In the British voice. <laughs> <laughs> but it's sorry. She agreed to link me. Oh, my. But what about giving her a, a, a towel and, a, and, a, and a, a soap and a rag to... Or you shower her. You give her a nice shower. Scrub her down. You don't think that could have been a possibility? I mean, Devoy? I'm, I'm just... Why are you both... Like, Cassidy's like wondering, what is she talking about? And you're like, well, let us be quiet for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> No, you're being nice. Lady C, that smell shouldn't leave her out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. But you need to assist her, give her some spray or something, because maybe she doesn't have it. You know, but ladies, please. If you're going to check a dude because you choose to, ensure that you are, you know, up. Well, good smell is up, right? Yeah, make sure of that, man. <coughs> Real talk. Real talk. Mm. Oh boy. Unfortunately, that was a bad experience for you, Devoy. Osh. Yes, Osh. But um, like. Oh boy. <laughs> so for your relationship. We had to go there. I have. It's it's in the Vox Pop. And maybe yes, maybe it's true, Carla. Maybe it's true. You know. Yeah. See what our mind. All right. So relationship. I've had some good experiences. Some bad experiences and some really, really good experiences too. Care to share? Care not. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> can somebody... <laughs> Call us please on 453 can, can I can tell you this though. I have learned 
from the bad experiences. Mm. And there are things I have decided that I am just not going to let befall me again. Mm -hmm. So there are certain things that I would have done that I'm no longer going to do. And there are some upward mobility that you need to do. And I need to go towards that. Climbing the ladder. Progress. Upward. Moving. Yeah? So that's where I'm heading. No more lower level. No more static. Growth, me say. And I'm going to be growing. From strength to strength. Okay. Stronger, better. Me don't tell you say you stop grow a long time. So, <laughs> but then you, say, no, you have to grow mentally and you have okay. to grow psychologically and even emotionally. Growth. And I think that's where I'm heading. It's big and serious. So it sounds good. Can't stay on one level. You have to grow. It sounds good, kind of boring, but it sounds good. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, there's something I want. To, I want. It's not, not a resolution, but I really, 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 really have a passion for this thing. And I'm going to be urging my DJs out there. DJs of Styles of M Radio, I urge you, I implore you, I dare you, <laughs> teach Lady Cleo to play that, what's the name of that thing? Sor what's the name of that thing? Sorata? You see, I even didn't know, the, know the name of it. What name? Sorata. It's a Sorata. You didn't know that. I knew that. Guess the kind of, six, six, guess six, the kind six, of six, character, six, please. Okay. Two. Torato. Torawo. Where's the other one? Where's it? <laughs> Somebody. Oh Lord. I'm sure I'm not deaf. <laughs> I'm sure I'm not deaf. I'm urging DJ four five six seven eight. DJ stand them up. DJ digital T, musical ingenious. Um, um, DJ Flair. DJ Moki. DJ Cassidy, DJ Chongy, DJ Colin Anthony, the girls, them sugar. So I'm the DJ Rude. The man with all the money and the honey. Oh, yeah. All the owners. So I'm the DJ Rude. Who am I leaving out? Oh my. King. Who am I leaving out? King Mitchell, the very humble dude. Who am I leaving out? Me. No, leave out nobody, you know. Me. DJ O, you? DJ Rude. No, sir. I'm not at all. I'm not, <laughs> <laughs> not stressed with you on a, on a Friday night. That's enough. <laughs> so, all my DJs, them, I implore you. I dare you. I challenge you. Unless you're afraid of Lady Cleo, then you wouldn't teach her to play the Serato. <laughs> Serato? I need, to, I Serato. Okay. I need to learn to play the Serato. I need to be able to come up in the clubs and wherever with you guys and just challenge the Ola Unz. <laughs> I'm mashing her up. What do you take this thing for? Look here. You think them start so good when them start? Them start looking at nothing to do, don't it? And couldn't do nothing. So strong it, eh? Grew out of the world and gone and lead and all these things. So me want to learn that thing because when me learn that, you know, when you can't tell about my, my, I have gifted hands, you know, and a gifted mind, you know. And so when I put my mind and my heart and my hands to that thing, <laughs> DJ, D DJ Mookie just a run gang one side and see me a come. My girl. <laughs> and DJ Flair just say, yo, clear our road. I'll, I'll stand them up. <laughs> Look here, my dear, you know, teach me. Sister. Teach me how to play. Teach you me have how gifted to play. hands for certain teach me things. <laughs> You're right about that. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, it's, it's, but it, it's not. Serious, guys, I really want to. All you men of stars are so super talented. Please teach a, a desperate damsel in distress. To play the Serato, please. A, hey, what a good thing, so I can't do this. I would have run you, see, because that is <laughs> a re reverse psychology. That we are going to use Rambo Cheswick. Where's Cheswick? Cheswick is in Dalvey Division. Dalvey, um, that's in Thomas. Go to, hmm. right, go to, what is her name? Um, right there, sir, at the gas station. Mm -hmm. You take the left, right there, sir, pass the school. Duckinfield? Pass at the Duckinfield area. Okay. Cheswick. Oh, yeah, I think that's not a sign. Yeah, yeah. Rambo, I like your name because I love the movie. Your pass, your, 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 your pass, the place, so where near? You know, place, the place. No, man, the, oh. the, the, the clinic, the big clinic. And you take a left after the clinic, right? There's right. so straight that's down, right? That's so. confuse me now. Right. We last, we last, yes, all right. Oh, no, a comedian. <laughs> 
full joy the program straight big up yourself yeah stars massive on large big up to all the people who lock in but nah check in Rambo. <laughs> condolences. <laughs> Rambo. <laughs> Con uh, Winsome says condolences to Yard. And families Family abroad, abroad that lost, lost their, their lives. lives. Yeah, and real thing. Families be strong in the fire. Pick up True. yourself. Thanks, Winsome. Thank you so much. Uh, Richard from the UK. Pick up yourself, Richie Rich. Bless up every time, yeah? Nadette in Golden Grove said, This one nice. One finger gone. Nine <laughs> left. This shot. Can I tell you? Oh, it shot. <laughs> oh, boy. So, I'm going to do a timetable for the gentlemen of Styles. Mm -hmm. And you tell me when you can fit me in. And I will fit, find, get myself um, here or there. You know, you're born up a while ago, though. How so? Oh, the man have to tell you when you, when them can fit you in, fit you in our. No man, no, nothing for fit in. Oh, they know that if you say, man. That's what I said. No, man. You say you men of style, let me know when you can fit me in. <laughs> As I'm <laughs> glad I'm not DJ, you know. You can't have enough fit in business to be in my girl. Oh, every day. Yes, every day. I left out every day. Mm. Oh, every day you're not DJ. Every day, every day, oh, well, no, but. Yeah. Did I say Chungi? Every day, every day is a is, is a music teacher. Oh, I wanna play the yes, every day. I wanna play the keyboard too. Everything with your finger? Yes, my fingers are very talented. I told you, I have gifted hands. Thank you, Jesus. Must we need for, need dumpling and cut banana and all them so they can nothing else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the people on the video are seeing you, okay? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> so, <laughs> and it's sweet, Cassidy. Nah. No. Tiffany from All I Thought, Tiffany from Prospect St. Thomas. You guys have me laughing. That is absolutely great to know. Can I tell you? Keep it going, girl. Keep it going. I know Prospect. I know Prospect too. I drove past there and I'm going into Mark Bay. I know within Prospect. Okay. You know Doppel River? No. You know Doppel River? No. You have a place in a Prospect named Doppel River. No, you that yet. Yeah. You know why not the river? Doppy? <laughs> <laughs> You're a lunatic. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hey, Cass. Well, I think for me still, me go overseas in the summer and me drive and, and straight up, I have this phobia because of the whole heap of um, issues with the police and them something there. I did genuinely have this phobia driving and anytime time I see a police vehicle, I get tense. Mm. Believe you me, man. I just picture myself get called out of the vehicle and all that. I force me to come out of my mouth, I'm a tourist. I'm <laughs> a tourist. Right? I can't think of nothing else. I just, just, just start feel lick all over my skin already. <laughs> and, and it used to really and truly have me for a while and then I get settled in and thing. Oh, and boy. And boy, me just, me, just, me just never see nothing else so, so kind of <laughs> grim with the whole part of violence and, and, and mm. I, I don't know what, what really was happening over there, but it's, 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 it's terrible, you know? You hear about the man since, since um, over the weekend he killed himself? No. Another? Yeah. No. Lord have mercy. Me now I spread no false news and I do people. All right, so don't. Let me spread the fire. Oh, news. by the way, Andy, yes, we are looking at that. Definitely, it's on. It's, it's all in the pipeline. My ears are the man. My ears mm -hmm. are the man. Um, electrocuting himself. How so? Stealing light? No. Just checking. Hmm. Lord have mercy. Do daddy road. It's having a problem, man. No. You know what, people? Me I left you alone, but me I go tell Cleo half year and how you going on. Oh, because God. what I tell Cleo is an eyewitness account. Account, okay. Yes, an eyewitness account I tell Cleo. But me, I was actually listening to the news. Um, which, which day was Christmas Day? Uh, Sunday? Was yeah, it yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I know it was well, a, a Sunday. Sunday was celebrated on a Monday. Yeah, so a Sunday, a Sunday was the... Either Sunday I go on or Saturday night I go on. And... You know what, people may not tell you. Not tell Clear exactly, half year. Not tell, not tell Clear half year. In the meantime, let me just say shout outs to my dog Pitbull. Yeah. Yeah. Big, 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 big bad dog Pitbull. Oh, always check in for Lady Cleo. 
Big up, big ups every time, Sean. Keep it locked to styles. All right, you're large. We have a caller on the 954. Good night to you, caller, and welcome to the show. I presume this is Dan Dan. Good night, how are you? Good night, Charmy, Charmy. No, this is Carly. Who is it? Hello? Hello? Oh, good night. Can hardly hear you, darling. You sound a bit muffled. Hi, Daddy Ruth. How are oh. you? Hi. Oh, this. It's Carleen. I'm a bit worried. I have four children. Carleen. Carleen. Oh, it's Carleen. Hi. <laughs> yeah. How are you doing? Wait. I am not. I guess I'm not as good as you. I'm not 100%. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, oh we had a call. Yeah. No, I'm not cold. Mm. The is on, and I'm all wrapped in my bed. Oh, boy. I oh, know wow. the feeling. I spend a little time in England, and I'm not go back, you know. I throw a stone back at me. Really? That the long journey when they put me in, I'm not go back in there. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to wear any more long john? Eh? You don't want to wear any more long johns? He doesn't want to wear any more. I don't want to wear any more long johns. I tight them put me in. I never feel so proud of myself. I'm ashamed of myself, but for survival, I do it. It's not tight. It is not tight. Well, why? For me, look like tights. Bird. Bird season. So what's up? Sure, it was a long journey wearing on my tights. Why you think it's why you think it's fat versus long job? Eh, me hardly hear though. Me hardly hearing. No, I'm asking, are you sure it is a long job? Not a tight you are wearing because it, you, you have to No ma I'm going to a tight store tight and then tell me say a long job the name. Because hey, okay. the, the the name alone did make me phobia a kick in. Long John. Oh, you're wearing a John. Jesus oh, well. It's long John. <laughs> I'm coming out. <laughs> All right, so can we not hear so well here? Thanks for calling, though. No problem. No problem. All right, all right and love. all the very best for 2018 18. and beyond, my True. darling. All right, um, Gracie, we want to hear from you. We haven't heard from you in a long time. Gracie, give us a shout out. Gracie, yeah. she run late. <laughs> so last week, Last week, though, you were reading something, and I was very disappointed mm -hmm. that, you, that you didn't finish the whole rough sex <laughs> thing. <laughs> no, the painful one. Ugh. The so, painful article. Yes. Mm. So I would ask persons to let us allow Cleo to finish this article that she started reading last week, and the article <laughs> was titled... 15 dirty ways to have oh, the boy. sexiest rough sex. And the one we clear never so like was the one where you squeeze in short. <coughs> and right now, it's what that hurt me. And I don't say nothing wrong if you take a, a squeeze short now and then. Can I squeeze your throat right now, please? No. <laughs> nothing is wrong if you take a squeeze short right now. <laughs> uh, I, I, I know a woman for squeeze man short. <laughs> Oh, can you imagine people? I don't oh, want to squeeze man short. Hmm. Oh, you know, so I learned something in the Bible one day. Mm -hmm. I never know, but I was trying to get my facts straight. But you know, normally I don't get my facts straight. Yep. Right? But <laughs> there's a part of the Bible, that one man of the Bible, where they say, I am the father of all nations. Hmm. I must say Jacob or Abraham or one of them, man. The same lineage or whatever it is, right? Mm hmm. But one of them now, one man in the Bible, fiend wife, can't get no yacht. And father say, yo, my lady, Bill, you'll get a yacht. <laughs> but she frustrated, she had 90 something. Mm -hmm. And can't run no yacht. So she said to the man, say, yo, road boy, you hear one You see a maid? How is she name? I got, what name is the maid name? She run the maid for the man, tell the man, say, boy, if you sort out the maid and get a yacht. Mm. And the woman gave the man a maid. And the man sought out the maid and get a yacht. 
and the woman now can say, he only thing wicked now, for sure there's certain things that I, I travel for a long time. The woman cast out the woman and the pitney get jealous, cast out the woman and the pitney. I saw you have certain divide now. We are going on Israel right now, you know. Because they must say, fear, because the woman end up get a pitney afterwards, you know. And I saw the divide go on now. And the man too pitney them, you know. But it's like say, boy, they must say the book say, fear pitney are the right pitney. And the other one under the right pitney. And I saw you have certain divide in a Palestine child. right now. But you see the thing about it, road boy, and the same thing I cause the said problem. This something. <laughs> this something I said problem. Because you see, you, see, you see if the wife did bill and just shall live. You know, you know give me article. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, give me an article, yeah. yeah? Rasta give me the, live. <laughs> give me the article. Certain too. problem will not go on nowadays. Saying, ladies and germs, uh, it is now one minute after eleven o'clock. The time is brought to you by VJ Printing Services and Real Talk. <laughs> I was about strangle. Yeah, like, Listen, and Real I Talk is sponsored by Native Audio. Yeah, you pill them for you, yeah? <laughs> Native Audio and Stage Equipment Services. We so far. Proud. When we get back, Cleo is going to read why rough sex is important. Oh, Jesus. Architects, draftsmen and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high quality white paper printing that is water resistant and never fades unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266 Party people at DJ Bubba Talk Me a Tabo Prinius and Trust Present St. Thomas Mead Portland Stars Among Stars Fully Black Club Atlantic Manchinville Portland Me a Tabo December the 29 You don't know everybody roll out Give away so all night I'm me a Tabo Kids fun me and treat all day So follow out to the kids I'm in the day I'm me a Tabo Powered by the bad son from out of Poland Next international Special guest DJ Fleer And the bad son from out of St. Thomas Galaxy Sound Special guest Rich Elias I'm here to have a live bitch and video, you know You don't know some ladies that make sure to follow out in the food colors Admission, $300 After 12, 4 bills Hosted by Grand Spen December the 29th I and I DJ Baba said the one you go loud Holy golly! <laughs> Your Saturdays will never be the same again. 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on Styles FM. Get the showdown. Social commentary. Tune, no, tune. No, 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 no. E Edge, your love with love song. Oh, happening. Between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. on the People Station, Styles FM, 96.1, 96.5, 96.7. Only the smooth sailing with Colin Anthony. Shotgun to the fame. Ladies and gentlemen, let's roll as the La Best family presents Pure Diamond Ball. The Errol Flint Marina Ignite, Kenwright Pier, Port Antonio, Portland. New Year's Night, Monday, January 1st, 2018. Music by Digital T and DJ Gemini. Admission 500 pre sold, 1000 at the gate. Revelers, get ready. Remember Styles FM on social media. View us on YouTube at Styles FM Radio. Follow us on Instagram at Styles FM. Like us on Twitter at Styles FM 961. Become a fan on Facebook, Styles FM 96.1. 
native audio and equipment rental services, now offering stage lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, play, wedding, street party, or even club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native audio and equipment rental services, proud sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Welcome back to Real Talk and of course big ups to friends in Bath, St. Thomas who are locked in right now. Moms, big up yourself, big up yourself, Toms. Um, not feeling so well, I know, but keep it, keep it locked. All right, Mr. Bailey, big up yourself every time. They're locked in and they can hear us in St. Thomas. All right. And, um, and Alka, say for big up. Alka, say big up. Miss Mo Lickley, mommy, over yeah. there in Springfield, Barking Barking Lodge. I see that. St. Thomas, see too, the, right? the, the maid name. <laughs> see that. All right. Me, me, me show you our life set. Yeah, Agar, Agar, something. The, the, Agar, the, the wife was Sarah and her husband was Abraham. The, the name. Don't let you know your Bible, though. The name, <laughs> the, 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 the name Agar alone. Jesus. I sure. don't know why, why they can't make me tell some name star. <laughs> Agar. <laughs> I don't mean, like, you could have a different name, you know what I mean? It's not Agar, it's Agar. It's a pretty name than, than Agar. It's not Agar, it's Agar. It's you prettier. sure? It's Agar. 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 Hagar. Agar. Hagar. Hagar. <laughs> <laughs> Eyeball. The bus driver from St. Thomas locked in. My, Pick up yourself, Eyeball. Madly, madly, madly. So we have bright here and we have Eyeball. You have eyelash too. <laughs> well, on so, so which one right? Is it Hagar? It's Agar. I'm bad meeting you that when you're not going to wear there. Where is Aga from? <laughs> aga. That was some Aga Aga. Yeah, but I hold me, I hold me seat the same time. I don't know about no Bible, you know, my girl. I don't know about no Bible business. No, no, English. But I tell you what, so, 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 so Abraham now, Abraham, woman, Sarah. Wife. Same difference, my girl. Game. I got me to say a while ago. That's not my head. It's just too stush. He got too stush. I know my language that, man. I feel language that. You're an English teacher, I know my God. I can't manage. Listen, uh, right? <laughs> so in game him, <coughs> and he sat out, and then the woman get becks and cast out. I learned where the cast out the woman at the call. How if a cast out the woman and pick me? You can't cast out. The Dan Pickney. Oh boy. It don't look right. Hmm. All right, so. <coughs> it don't look right. <coughs> Let's go to our little article here, lovepanky.com. And of course, we're continuing on this old. Oh boy. Daddy, Daddy Rose article about. Sorry. We saw look at here, Shanna. The 15 dirty ways to have the sexiest. Rough sex ever, and guess what? If your partner and you are not compatible, then it really makes no sense. You're talking about any rough sex because incompatibility and rough sex, I don't think they go well together. All right, so let's look look at that. So let's get back to that part. I lost it for a minute there. All right. So up oh, here we come. Incompatible partners and rough sex. So your your partner now mesh now connect. Certain way, if you feel something too big and you're a thing too small and you're feeling pure pain, <laughs> don't bother with it. Yeah? I'm going to kill yourself, my girl. Do. Rough sex oh my goodness. and incompatible <laughs> in other ways too, right? If you can give you how you want it somewhat and consider your feelings too, forget it. No, but if, 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 if the you man know? lively and you're dead, if daddy. you don't want to be it before you him come on and, and, and start the thing, then run that. No, yeah, fresh no, say every time. Yeah, no, so, part incompatible is. partners and rough sex. Rough sex is all good and dandy, as long as both of you are having fun. But are you in a relationship where only one partner enjoys rough sex while the other doesn't? Sometimes, a partner who feels emasculated yeah. or weak around you may use rough sex to feel more powerful. Do. I think you But I feel... Less than a man around me. Eh -eh. Because rough sex something. With them at top, not this me at top, but you know. 
that rough something out of my top, but with the pain something in it. In it. Yeah, what I mean, yeah. it's a yard man thing in my girl. That mm. make it knowing. If your partner is using rough sex to feel dominant in a relationship, yeah. that's not good for you or for the relationship. Again, if you're incompatible a certain way, no bother with the rough something. It's not for you with that partner. Hmm. Even while having sex, make sure both partners indulge in equal rough play. I agree with that. No. Unless one of you intentionally likes to be submissive more often, it's very important that both partners take control equally while having rough sex. So if you want to come tie me up with handcuff, I oh, mean, and 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 curt, what, um, string and cord and all these things, and strangle try and know say when me done my tie up, I feel your time for tie up. No. And if you want blindfold me, your turn for blindfold. No. And if you want whip me. <laughs> Your turn to get some whipping, <laughs> yeah, and all these things. So it should go both ways, all right. And what about about mention the chop, the chop next story? Why uh, all next story? Why Marlene? Me feel it for you. The, the call up there, me feel it for you, Marlene. Brompton, Canada. Oh, it's freezing, Whoa. girl. If I'm in this studio and it's freezing, I can imagine where you're at. I can just imagine where you're at, girl. Hmm, mm, hush. But I hope we're warming you up a little bit, yeah? Or hubby helping to warm you up. All right. So, and try a little bit of this rough thing. You have to see if it can get even warmer. Yeah? I'm um, here, <laughs> Right now, I call toilet seat up at England. Then. Oh, Jesus. So, we are here. Oh, yes. It's very important that both partners take control equally while having rough sex. Another worry to keep in mind is the addiction. If you're having rough sex... The first few times, the idea may be intoxicating and arousing. But if one of you gets addicted to it and don't get turned on by the gentler kind of sex, cut down on the rough sex until both of you can function sexually without having to resort to bruising or hurting each other. Bruising, oh. I mean, <laughs> must be mad. let me ask a question. Who's wrong your star? L let, me, let me ask you a question. Hmm. Hmm. For the first time, mm -hmm. fr from a man's standpoint, the first time you kind of want to prove a point to them. Mm -hmm. All right? And I've realized that with women, it's pretty much the same thing. Yes. Right? But, but go so, as rough as she will allow you so, to. So, 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 so nobody now back down. Right. But Cassidy. Yes. <laughs> but Cassidy. <laughs> <laughs> You're being distractive, <laughs> right? <laughs> you are distracting me, Lady Cleo. <laughs> Cassidy, big man thing. You ever realize that uh, after maybe like say three, four months in a relationship when you start to say I love you and all those things, you can't perform certain level again? Because I like that too. Because people are easier. <laughs> The ease of part. You've already proven yourself. What are you trying to prove again? You want to kill somebody? No, somebody but, to kill? no but based on how, remember, you know, based on how the story start. It start up on a certain level, you know. It's, a, it's a high point, yeah. But every story, every movie goes up to a high point and you come right back down. So it'll get boring. No, coming towards the end. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I really sit here. I really sit But the bad side of rob sex, don't get carried away. I like this part. Rob sex, just the way it sounds, is rough. You're dealing with sensitive body parts here. That's right, man. A true man. Real mm. talk, man. I know about Don't that. remember to be gentle while playing in the hay. As they say, never do anything that you wouldn't want to explain to the paramedics. A true mm. uncontrolled rough sex yeah. can leave a guy broken, broken and a out. girl bruised. Broken out. Here are a few cautions, Cassidy. You need to keep in mind. Stand them up. I hope you're listening. One. Broken penis. No, no, no. If a no. girl sits down heavily on mm. the guy aggressively, or the guy aggressively penetrates deep, this is definitely possible. Gentlemen, 
Stop trying to prove on yourself and I go hard. Boop, 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 boop. You will break your penis. <laughs> <laughs> that felt good to say. <laughs> I know. Top reader sit there. Yeah. So, so Ken Roy. <laughs> Kevron, rather. Kevron Dawkins Field say hi. Love good sex. Good sex is good, but rough sex can be dangerous. It can break your penis. Be careful, gentlemen. Please. Um, right. I hope Digital T is also listening. All my mm. brothers are listening, I hope. Two. Penetrating painful. too deep in a horrid motion, Cassidy can damage a girl's cervix mm, mm. which can lead to bleeding or bruising so me talk about me no depend no hardcore nothing like a demia with nobody <laughs> three I think I care, baby, it's is this. difficult cassidy I to control ejaculation and orgasms while having rough sex are true so you're gonna end up impregnating the poor girl we never even ready for you have no baby <laughs> because you have got so hard and so coarse and so rough you have to get say so you must do a withdrawal or you must put on your your your, your plastic on your willy before you go enter and all these things because you're in the rough 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 you have to be mm. conscious and think number four your protection can get damaged while doing the rough nasty are true the rough nasty that's right name the rough nasty <laughs> yo <laughs> yo that sound burn up the rough so, nasty you put on the condom if you're not careful not because it's it, 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 it think it's always always latex and whatever what it can it? burst if you have got too hard the condom will burst it can burst and you can get yourself into problems not only pregnancy but uh, can of something can happen to it if you don't know what this person you know what i'm saying yeah Five, rough, nasty. tears in the vaginal walls due to aggressive rough sex. You must be Cassidy. mad. You don't want to go back there and want to come tear up my walls. You must be mad. Before there's a rough sex, no, they must have a rough, nasty. What is rough, <laughs> nasty? He must have been pain. Look at his face. He's yeah, in pain. I mean, I like a rough, if nasty you song, notice any painful swellings, up, if you notice any painful swellings or bleedings after rough sex, Consult your doctor, especially the symptoms last for more than a couple of days. No, me go want back more after this. You want yeah, come more mash me up. You want back more? No, me go want back more of the thing. If you go <laughs> mash me up uh, to begin with, me now can't get back no more after. No, me if I go, go heal, like me the hospital. No, sir, no rough sex around here. Mm -mm. Communicate your desires. Rough sex is a lot of fun. It's aggressive, wild passionate and steamy but too much of a good thing always makes everything bad <laughs> too much of one thing good for nothing so them say yes use rough sex to mix in with other kinds of kinky sex you know what i mean no <laughs> and if there's something about rough sex you don't like or if a particular scenario in bed scares you talk to your lover about it rough sex should be a passionate escape for both of you, not just for one selfish partner. Me agree. Any oh yeah, go no rough and me kick kick with that. Why are you around me? <laughs> huh. I have a code word to know when to stop. Me love, stop is enough of a code word. <laughs> tap, 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 tap. Done. Mm. Me not play. Stop. Hmm. I don't play so business. both of you know when things get out of hand while having rough sex but as long as you keep the cautions in mind go on out there and have the wildest rough sex ever for those who want to still wondering how to have rough sex well use these 15 types of rough sex and keep these rough tips in mind hmm. and you will definitely have a sexy dirty and wild time in bed with your lover <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. I find certain things about that. Me mm. me me just me just zone off your table so the sitting can be broken. You know? Me know man. Like, me I'm glad that was off. the first one. I am glad that was the first the, part. Kind of part that could be when that table thing can be broke. Yes, Why rough nasty bothering you, Daddy Road? That's what Car it, Carlin wants to it know. It doesn't sound right, man. What do you mean by nasty? Rambo says, hold on now. If the penis break. What is the treatment? <laughs> Plaster, Plaster Paris, Paris, of course. <laughs> or severance. Severance. <laughs> you know, go there, sir. <laughs> Shelly, if Shelly I listen, tell us. Because I, I, I think Shelly mentioned before that while she was um, practicing as a nurse, she has seen incidents of there being broken penis. <coughs> so it would be good to know what 
what heals that broken as in dead it may not <laughs> <laughs> Ben up, cause when Shelly that expensive. And it's what it have most of contraction. Adapt, Some most something contract. like 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 all the man a perform, the man a perform and the thing all slip out and boop on the bed. Oh my god! You know what I mean, or slip out and boop on the lady to like on the, the flesh there. Wherever it's I like go, Ben up. It, it, oh. it bend up and stay bend and up. Most of contract, you know. Most of contract. Yeah. They so can have most of contract. Yeah, because they mostly take blood. I mean, no, but if it's been up, must, it can't track up, man. It can't track up. Good night, guys. Just locked in. Guess I missed a lot. Oh, yes, KDN. Big up yourself, by the way. Yeah, for keeping it locked to stars right throughout the year and to real talk. Yeah. More, more ask um, hmm. Marlene. So, Marlene in Canada. Can I remember when we were in England? Mm. The toilet seat used to call. <laughs> the, the houses are warm, they have heaters. So, well, I don't mean I ask because me is at some minus 17 or minus oh 14 God. and then place there. Hmm. I don't have a no? <laughs> I don't know about nobody, but I don't have a beard. You're going to wash the possibles, beard. right? I said I don't have a beard. You're going to wash the possibles, though? Not no possible. For crying out loud. I said not no possible. You have to at least wash your possibles, man. With what? Well, warm water. From where? <laughs> you, you, hold on. You ever watch the news yet when them say Niagara Falls freeze and pipe water freeze, the water in the pipeline freeze? Wow. Oh, your beard. What kind of possibility is there for wash? Go buy water at the store and beard. Well, me, you know, you know that one. I'll stay in the, 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 the tropics. No, in the tropics. <laughs> I'll stay in the tropics. <laughs> I, I'm quite fine in the tropics. Oh, Lord. Remember, the phone lines are open, guys. We have 453-124 well, and 954-338-7973. All right. It is the final show for, for 2017. This, for 2017. So we're just kind of take it a little bit mellow. We're not go overboard and all them something there. There's a part of another article I want you to read, you know, up to the <coughs> break, right? And I think this is going to be interesting to us as guys. The toilet seat is cold, she says. Then I don't know talk about, man. Me, mm. you know what mother do now? No, but I will pay that bond on a fine. Me, I say mother get the, 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 the big and spray. Oh, Jesus. With, with, the, with the Cassidy, with the, with, with the lighter. You know, when they dance, mm -hmm. and use that and warm up the seat. <laughs> and then you go do what you have to do. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, people? He is just wanting somebody else to have a... A, Good day. A, 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 no, a, um, that moment <laughs> where you light up the whole place. And fireworks for you. No. Call on the 954. Good night. Lady Cleo, how are you? Oh, Dan Dan. How are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm, I, pl I pledge to go easy on you tonight, Miss I was Ms. wondering Cleo. where you're at, my brother. Nah, ma, my ears, my ears in tune, ma. I'm not looking out. Oh, that may say because may say, oh, no, I can't go through the end, end of the year without Dan Dan. I have nah, to hear it from nah, Dan Dan. Out, man. We have to do that road. Well, I'm there, road boy. May I read some of the comments from the people. Them say, boy, Colin say, enough moly people they're on the bus up are fine there right now. Enough <laughs> of them not a beard. And I paraphrased it. <laughs> in Patois. Why? <Right. laughs> in, 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 in the past two weeks, you know. I'm, I must say, I must say, one day the, the, the temperature go above freezing up, you know. Oh. And I knew I'm there, you know. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> me, me not the, me not the Canada. Road boy, me not take no check with upper far in them. Me throw all stone back at me. I, I, I would love to hear Dan Dan. What are, uh, what is your relationship highlight for 2017? Um. Be it good or bad. No, man, everything, everything, everything good, man. Man, man, in the ups and downs, the, the, okay. The, you know. Well, give me a highlight, you know, man. The, um, the, you know, the, you know, the Chinese people, the Confucians, love say keep things at an even keel. Yeah. Yeah, well, I, 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 I mean that. So, give me one of those high moments. <laughs> no, man, everything even, man. No, no, no. No, 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 I know low. So give me one of the even moments then, my love. Because you think you try to grow up. No, no, I have no, I have no, I have no low moments. Give me one of the even moments, I say. Even moments. Oh, my gosh. 
Oh my um, gosh, no. I can't really zero in for any, any you know. <laughs> but there were so many, huh? Let's have, have to give thanks for, for good health and them thing there. Yeah. Real talk. <clears throat> But 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 more and draw more and draw the, the analogy with um with Dolly Root met both Sierra and Agar. Mm-hmm. Oh Sierra, which is Abraham's wife, give Agar her maid to to Abraham. Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> See, it's just it's just, I, 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 and then and then Abraham left to make her go because that was Sierra said. Mm-hmm. Wife. All right. Old. It's from from way back at them time, you know. Mm-hmm. And this is not Genesis, you know. From way back at them time, you know. Woman did have the power to run things like that, you know. <laughs> All right? Mm-hmm. So, <clears throat> so, I'm just saying, um, the, oh, the Bible, uh, the Bible in most times paint the world as if it's a man's world. But it's really, it's really a woman's world. We know that. It's a woman's right? manipulated world. Yeah. No, Family. you say it's a woman's Second. world, leave that that man, you boy, yeah. No matter come follow daddy road. It's a woman's <laughs> world, full stop. Secondly. Go ahead, sir, yes. Secondly, yeah. it's, 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 in other it, it was it was normal for your it was normal for your um, for your wife to get another another girl for your husband. I don't think I don't, I don't think nothing about it. Yeah man, go go, go do my go do my my friend man. Why no no we are talking we 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 where have we gone wrong? <laughs> we gone wrong because the man decided to go out the guitar for himself. Allow the wife to get one for you if she so desires to get one for you. That's a difference. Oh, yeah. So, oh, so, 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 and if we don't yeah, for it, in those we're days, against see? it. In those days, men and women were living till them all 600. So uh, when mm-hmm. um, when the woman are 90 yard, she decides if we send on somebody upon Abraham. Now what kind of youth yeah. daddy would have at 75? That's the whole point. No Much less 90 yard. So <laughs> nothing I send on right now. So we don't have to go, go look it for myself. And that we are talking about. Ah. Ah, yes, 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 why? Because my, 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 my youth outside are coming. You know, I use the word outside. Yeah. You feel really, you feel really congratulating by cigar frame and and throw a party for him. Dan, you know, Dan. Because at the last show for the yeah. year, not do this, not do this to me. Do. No, no, match me up so <laughs> night, and me a big a No, clear. Not easy by you. Yeah, your friend Dan, Dan. Good God, man. We can't clear, end clear, the year clear. with no, malice and and, and with, anger, man. Not, and and. Clear. Not easy by you. No, no rough. Um, no rough sex. <laughs> oh my goodness. But <laughs> uh, still, though, more, 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 big up bright eye, my yes. style's personality of the year. I tell you. Madly, madly, <laughs> madly. So bright eye, anyway, big up. I'm big up Keisha. All right. Thanks, cool. Dan, Dan. Thanks for keeping it locked. We love you so much. Thanks a lot for keeping it right here with us, all right? Right throughout the year. And keep it going for 2018. Yep. All right. So um, we're almost up on a break. Um, hmm. But in terms of <laughs> in terms of this, 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 this whole um, Bible thing, when I really pray it, I think the whole symbolic reason for that is more the, the how would I put it, the the jealous factor. I think that's the most symbolic part about it. I don't think it's the the intimacy part. It's the jealous factor of now there's a child and then may, maybe some amount of affection is being showed 
by and, and those things happen to show us that we shouldn't go that route now in this dispensation mm. because these things can affect wives and women that's what it's, it's showing us we should not be following those um dispensations back then we need to learn now from this a man should leave his mother and father and cleave to his wife one wife not get no children outside because when she come in there with a the pitney hey we go and run you out and whoever forget run out or get run out so it's not supposed to go that way Anyways, we are on a break. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get it tight on the article before we go to the break. 20 moves to last longer during sex without any difficulty. Like one hour, hour and a half. Yeah, yeah 45 idiot. minutes. Oh, you must have no three that. minutes moves around here. You must yeah, mad. it's not. Me, me not me not prove nothing. And you want to prove it in a rough stick, boop, 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 do. And you know what? We get get you, over with. From you, because Fall you style, right rabbit now. style. <laughs> that would happen. <laughs> Dog is time. <laughs> we are on the 11.30 break, people. It's now 11.30, and the time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio and Stage Equipment Service. We soon come. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at Eight nine three two two six six. Join in the holiday magic at Great Touch Resort in Boston Bay on Christmas Day. Live in a jam down includes dinner and rhythm bank, Portland's reggae and jazz talents, and on New Year's Eve. Sip champagne atop Africana House, Porty's newest vacation retreat, where spellbinding views of the Caribbean form a pristine backdrop for a melange of art, nature, and entertainment by famed DJ Sheppy and Queen Zion. Reserve today at 993-8888 or email events at greathuts.com. It is worth the drive to Porty. Great Huts, paradise on the edge. Party people, are you ready? Stars 96 FM and DJ4, the illest present Detour. This and every Saturday night, 8 p.m. to midnight. Tune in for the best mixes, the better mixing, and nothing but vibes. Ladies, 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 it wouldn't be a party without the ladies. Ladies special detour hour, 11 p.m. to 12 midnight. That's the Saturday night detour. Stars 96 FM with the illest DJ4. 8 p.m. to 12 12 midnight, you just gotta tune in. New Beginning Entertainment present New Year's Resolution, Fun Day and Dance. Monday, January 1st at the New Beginning Entertainment and Shopping Center, Eric Yasso St. Thomas. Bounce about ice cream, fun activities for the kids, so roll them out early in the day. Juggling by Zone Warrior, Black Venom, Tender Touch, Lake of Cheaps, so a drink responsibly. This is Jatty, the Reggae Ambassador. Join me this and every Saturday from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. Right here in Styles FM 961, 965, 967 for the Tony Larvan show in style on style. We're gonna eat you off that G spot at 3 o'clock. We've got the collector's edition with Twin Spin. Inside music base with Teddy Ledley. Nuff, nuff niceness right here in Styles FM. This and every Saturday from 1 p.m. until 5 p.m. You got it? Do you have or are you seeking a place to rent, seeking employment or have a job vacancy? Are you selling a car or having a garage sale? Then come see us. Let Styles do the advertising for you and you'll be on your way in no time. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Advertising Styles. Advertise with Styles. 
native audio and equipment rental services, now offering stage lighting and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, play, wedding, street party, or even club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native audio and equipment rental services, proud sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Welcome back to Real Talk. Uh, we got a message here from Gracie, and Gracie says uh, she missed out on some of the show. Yeah, that's all right. We we still got you on board with us. Um, if I can bid a box in a winter, you can too. <laughs> of course, without hot water. Let me tell you something. We have one experience, cause. This one now, we, we did have to buy a token. What I remember when you name? You have to buy one something. Go to the post office and buy credit, pretty much. Mm -hmm. And put it in the meter to get electricity. Mm. Now, Where was that? Sheffield, England. Oh. Right. Now, I don't know the basement, and you know, basement naturally cold. So, you know, mm -hmm. so nobody really want to go down the basement. But you know, have a choice. And I remember one particular weekend, people, I tell you short. We never realized that we were using more energy than we normally use. Because we used to budget out how the expenditure I go go. Say, so, all right, you buy a five you buy, you buy a five pound token. Should be not the sitting that will last X amount of days. We use the same calculation, not recognizing say boy, we start using more energy, we are turning on the heat now. We are up the temperature on the heat because the place will get colder and colder and colder. You know what? Um, that run out over the weekend. Ouch. So light gone. Heat and our work. Wow. And you call. Mm. You, you have a beard. Did you? I mean, you wait for a certain time of the day, yes, but it never really worked out <laughs> quite well with me in there. So, you know, I want to beard that for the day. <laughs> and we find the post office the very first work in there. Luckily, I did this Sunday run out. So, May I tell you, say, boy, daddy, me, me dash toward the passport, everything back at me. If me not have to go back there, sir, mm. me not go back there, sir. When me there in the States, I me feel like a cold breeze blow up on me, me know, say, at time to go in my yard. Because, boy, me not know, boy, me have to take my hat off. Hey, let me tell you something, foreign people, straight up. Me respect, you know, 200%. All over their yard, I wait for certain things. Only if you got to find your experience, what them I got you up there. <laughs> me if my daughter, but she won't go no snow. I say, I must say, your mother alone, because me, not in a it with, oh no. You're too fat. That's the problem. Me no, we have hey. a call on the 954. <laughs> Hello, caller. Good night. Hey, Daddy Road. Yo. Let's talk about Spine, you know. I, I England really rough on a bus. Bossy. Hey. I don't know if you experience this. When you're in England, you don't have to, you have to be like, like you have two faucets, one have cold water, one have hot water. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I try to combine them. Yeah, in, 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 a, in a mix. What, 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 what we did you do now, we, we, we get one, um, one sitting, like one shower head, uh. where, 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 where you put one pan one side, one pan next side, and you end up in a one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but in in always work. It always work properly. Right? In always work properly. In always work properly. Always work properly. The cold water will just come out and. <laughs> Bridget, Mr. Man, yo, we don't even want to talk about your dinner because I start to feel cold, yes, you know. No, man, England dangerous, man. In hey, hey, clear. England are places now. Where's the people spitting out? Green spitting, mass spitting out. Well, I yeah, want to go there. The, 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 the cold, them cold, them cold is like antifreeze, you know. We're green, you know. I don't care how cold it is. I want to go there. Hey, try, try. If not go England, try, try not go in December, January. Go in, go in the, go in the spring. Okay. <laughs> you said no December, no January. Hey. Okay. Well, I know. Me done. Mm. So you see when all the Christmas holiday come, I may say, mm. yes, a Christmas and time or call and to pass. But my bridging time is a road boy. A February, the temperature really drop. You know, you know, me start feel depressed. Regin, 
I say exam done today the May 5th, but my <coughs> ticket buy for fly out May 6th. I not in a no uh more. Mm. <laughs> but I say, I don't know about nobody. You're lying. England, England, England. England, 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 I don't know about London and them pretty places, the Birmingham and whatever other place. I don't know about them places there. Me they are real country. <coughs> hey, mm. one of the wickedest things I see one day, you know. One man always a pass with his dog. And so the man a pass with his dog. What is the case? Day in, day out, certain time I day, the man walk in dog. And long after I realize the, the bag with the man have, with, with, with the dog, I dog sitting the night in the road, boy. I said, I said, a long after me realized I realized that the dog sitting in it. You know, so if me turn uh, government for Jamaica wanting that me implement though with the stray animal, them you have to walk with the dog sitting. You, know? you can't make your dog sitting and your animal sitting left for people yard and people yard gate and anything there. You know? But me now nah, forgot the day when me see the man shake one man hand. I'm sure the same dog and he use and shake the man hand. I never see which I didn't use and take it, but I assume yeah. say, naturally <laughs> you, 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 you use a strong arm <laughs> and take up certain things and your strong arm you're gonna use and shake. <laughs> yeah, the man but not the man wicked road boy. I said, men are not with them on the animal hey, road hey, boy. Hey, Cleo. Hey, that is I'm driving a um <laughs> me I driving a Birmingham one time, you know. And I and I, I, I stopped my ass away for some direction, you know. To me, it's a Jamaican lady, so so she, she show me, she give me the direction, and I show me for But but how she explain it now? She explain it as as if me live there. Oh. Sure I said, I really live there. So so I said, all right, tell her. What. Let me give you a ride. Let, let, let me drive you and you and you you point out to me. Me carry her go. So so we have a have a conversation and ask her. So how oh, oh, you like England? The woman said, I hate it. I hate it. The worst place in the world. I hate it. This <laughs> so I said, then if you hate it so much. Why, why, why did you attach yourself? She can't go back home because you know she. I she did it seven years now. She, she, she coming to make a, to make a living, a yeah. more promising living. But things not work out that way, then. Oh. And then, and then she can't really go back home because if she, she can go back home, she will look like a feel, a feel to everybody. Understand. All right. So, so yeah, man. So people, so people in Jamaica for know how difficult some people really, really run left. Run left Jamaica and a real and, thing, man. And real, yeah. And, and, and you know, see them again because you know, them, them, them just now make it like that. Them, them, not it can, it can be real rough, man. It, real rough. Then, 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 especially then England. Why, I mean, if, if, if me, if me go to England when me just left America, me sure be gone back, me come back the next, the next week. <laughs> England rough, man. <clears throat> But I say, me, me spend a couple months up there, I see it here, so, but I can't, can't do it. I have to rate the whole of them. I have to rate the, the whole of them. The thing is, no, with, with, with the, with the, the heating business is so expensive, you know, I'm going to show you. Know. When, when me, when, when I rent a car up there, you know, and I go to the gas station, you know, and me, and me are full up, and, and, and when, when, when the person say, when I realize, when I compare the, um, the, the, the price to, to America, because America I live, and I compare the price, and I say, oh, I guess about the same thing like here in America. Mm -hmm. When we realize that uh, in America, I, I get up that that you know, you know, over over the thing that liter. <laughs> I know it's a three, you know, the three liter make one uh, one gallon. A three, then I want to gas your peer, your yeah, peer, yeah, yeah. in England and, and America, you know. True. All right, and 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 then, and then you have to, you have to buy buy oil and um for, for each your ah. each your apartment uh, house. Different, so, a, different. A rough, so. some rough hey. life and people live on. When we did it, you know. We never know say so you have to pay for your radio. It's like when you have to pay for cable. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, you have to pay for your radio That's in a road boy. That's ridiculous. I met as a road boy. You have, you have BBC 1 and you have BBC 2, BBC 3. And I be a World War 1 and World War 2, they must show you, you know. <laughs> and you have some people, you have some people who regulate the thing with war crown, with one with antenna and test. 
Oh Lord. For no mm. OO in a house on this radio, you want to see we lie down power, power, power belly on the cold floor. Oh Jesus. Cause we no <laughs> want it, we no want them catch we. It's that bad. And one day, me a go home now, never know say them just cause I told the house is close. I just want to go passage passage way like between your yard and one next man's yard. So me a walk down the passage way now. Me never see my bridge that signal me now, like signal the plane. I tell me if I walk straight, <laughs> no come down the lane. <laughs> me never know see the regulator them there at the back of the yard and I beat down the door. Then catch me. All right, right. Clear. Hey. England, England come up on different world. Different oh, something, man. Wow. You have no, a pay for your radio, not, radio just nothing, like your pay for your TV. Like, Watch nothing TV. Nothing like Atlanta, um, Cleo. Nothing like Atlanta. I love Atlanta, too. Yeah, I love Atlanta. <laughs> yeah, I want to yeah, get yeah, there soon, by the way. Atlanta. It, <laughs> if, if you love Atlanta, you're not. You're, there's no way you can't, you can't love England. I know. I've been to Atlanta. Yeah. And it doesn't get... That, that 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 snowy thing like like some places it cannot get cool and hot yes but not you where know, drastic it, yeah you mean Atlanta yes no I'm not, oh, oh, hey one of my coolest days in my entire life Atlanta me feel it what are you talking about well I wasn't there at that Atlanta time apparently I was in, I was there in the summer oh well Atlanta get cold but it, 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 does, does it really it snow it not get cold it get cold but does it snow. Yeah, man, it it, it it not snow that much, but it get cool. Okay. Just I just just like England, England it, it not really snow that much in England, no. Mm. But it get cool. Mm. Cool, mm. bad. Mm. I don't know where it's snow. Yeah, yes, like, my yeah, darling. Thank you for calling. All right, so Canada. Gracie says Canada can get cold. Um, Carleen says I could not live in that situation. No, no. But I hear that New York was supposed to get snow tonight into tomorrow. I mean, I respond for them sure. and it's snowing up. Then can't keep that. But the first time I saw snow in Boston, Massachusetts, I went outside and I lay in it and I just do my hands on my feet like this. It was just really cool. Kaya really cool. country. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> that was my first snow, and they actually they actually woke me up to say, Hey, Cleo, come here. I'm like, what? Look, because I was complaining about where's the snow, where's the snow, where's the snow, mm. you know? Mm. So when it came, they called me and said, come, come here. I said, what? Look outside. I was like, oh, my God, my first snow. <laughs> it was exciting. It was exciting. The first time I hear about snow, my cousin, <laughs> my, my cousin did live in England. Long, long, long. Where a little boy? I ask her if she can put some in a one can care come. <laughs> you have so. for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Never know. Oh, I never know which never, never never traveled before, not like that. Carly so, says the gas and electricity system electricity system is different in the UK from the USA. I just learned from my father last week how it works. Yeah, man, a different something, man. Different, right. different something. So let's quickly go to this article here. Twenty moves to last longer during sex without any difficulty. Chinese brush. Hmm. Are you having a hard time holding on while having sex? Men? One minute men, two minute men, three minute men. It not said that. I'm, I'm just adding that part in case you're one of those persons, you know. <laughs> Here are 20 everyday tips, well, sex I'm, tips, and well, foreplay well, tips to well, hold that orgasm back for longer. Caller on the nine, on the four five three. Good night, caller. <coughs> Good night, Mr. Cleo. Hi, how are you, sir? Fine, thank you. And yourself? I am not too bad. How, mm -hmm. What's oh, going on now? I didn't that too. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I wanna I wanna talk a little bit about um England. Yes. It's cold, but the problem with England is damp. Yeah, damp for sure. Yeah. True, true. Oh. Sometimes you might be sitting in the house and you see water running down the wall. Seriously? Yes, ma'am. Wow. <clears throat> I spent thirteen and a half years there. Oh. <clears throat> and I went to New York. New York is colder than England. Mm. Mm. Yes, but you get better weather. Oh, you can, uh, you, can re you can rely on the summer. Oh, okay. In, uh, in England, you're not sure of summer. You're more sure of the winter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I lived in Birmingham for ten months when I just got there. I went uh -huh. in the sixties. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then I leave from Birmingham and went to London. And then I leave from London and go to New York. Oh, but I wouldn't go back to England because the journey it is too. It's like though that England is like though that 
Jackie out of the world altogether. <laughs> it feels that way for true. Really? Yeah, man, I would never go back there. Oh, wow. I, I've been back there on vacation, but you got to give England, regardless of what, they're more disciplined. Yes. Yeah, true. One thing, you know. Spencer, I, I, I don't have it, but I went there in 1961. Mm. I, left, I left there in 1974. Okay. okay. England, uh, well, it's a kind of, you, they, like I said, they're more disciplined, but, but I don't still have this um, um, problem with them, them believe black people are monkeys and all kind of stupidness. Really? <laughs> oh, yeah. Because them, them teach them children, tell them children that black people have teal and all that kind of thing. Wow. Yeah. So, and when you want all the time, you look up in the sky. Mm. And all that. So sometimes you look at kids you see on the street and say, what time is it? And you say, ask your mother. <laughs> <laughs> Lord have mercy. <laughs> ask your mother. Because that, that, that is the, um, the teaching that they get. Oh. Yeah. So, and, but then you have one and two of them. They are all right. Mm -hmm. So when, when I got there first, <clears throat> I used to work with a make aircraft, airplane. Okay. okay. Nice. And um, they sent me there as a, they, sent, they gave me a job as a plumber's meat. Mm -hmm. I was trying to learn the plumbing right there. Anyway, this guy, he was about the best plumber in the, in the shop. They had about five of them. He was the best one. And his remark when I got there, I was the only black person in the, in the plumbing shop. And he said, not to mind, I didn't hear him. But he said he said he's not working with no black man. Hmm. Mm. I'm, I'm, I'm really prejudiced, you know. But isn't that everywhere though? Because we could also uh, agree that we see that happening in the states just as much. I beg your pardon. I didn't hear that. Yeah, wouldn't you agree that it also happens in the states as well? It's pretty much yes. everywhere. Yes, but in America, most like they'll tell you straight up they don't want you here. Oh, okay. You'll understand that. Oh. The English people, they're not telling you anything. Oh, okay. They just ignore you. That's it. Oh. You got, you got a lot of problems, but you have to live there for a while to understand. Mm hmm and You go before, first time, you couldn't go in a pub and get a drink as a black person. Mm -hmm. The revenue is when um, Harold Wilson has a Labour Party, when they, win, when they won the election, the party law that no place at all must seek for some prejudice against black people. Okay. At that time, they start the black people and start to go in another place and make trouble. Oh, yeah. Right. Right. <laughs> half license, half license, they call half license, they sell the drinks in the bottle or so on. They don't, you can't drink anything in here, you just have to buy and come out. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I went in there and stood up there for quite a while and not a soul came in the mind, you know, not even much as. How are you, sir? Nothing. Mm. They just, yeah, man, they just ignore you till long after another people come in and it kind of look too bad now. Then say, like, uh, can I help you? Then you just buy a little drinks and come out if you don't want to go in the pub. You know, that, them ignore you. That's how they are. Okay. But well, it's not so, yeah, I don't think it's all that bad now. And Danny Rood? You. When you speak, when you speak about the, the toilet, I used to live at a place near the <laughs> outside, <laughs> outside toilet. Yes. Mm -hmm. So most of the, they, they might have one inside, but most of that, mo that one is most of the landlord use that. Oh. Uh. You as a tenant have to go use the one outside. Wow. Mm -hmm. You know the winter that you know you manage to the seat. <laughs> <laughs> you but might get glued to the seat, huh? <laughs> yeah, man. It, it kind of rough, it rough. But you know, after a while, you kind of get used to it, and then it starts to change. It's not so bad now, but I wouldn't live there again. No, not uh, all right. The heat, the heat, well, the heat is not so bad anymore because first time you never have central heating. You have okay. To buy the paraffin lamp. Wow. Par paraffin, you like curse, you know? Yes, that's way back now, burn, clearly. Yeah, I burn it from, I went to 61. Yes. Yeah, yeah, wow. It's a long time. Yeah, man. And then you cannot change up now because they use central heating. Mm -hmm. You have to drop your money in the gas to cook and all that kind of oh, thing. Oh, true, true, Technology. True. Technology has yeah, improved. 
everything all right now. All right. Anyway, I enjoy your program. Thank I'm you so a, much, sir. Yeah, man. I don't call in very often, but well, you're the English business. You know? Yes. <laughs> Something connected tonight. Well, we're glad you called. Thank you so much. So, um, when you're not on there, you're under the road. I really want, I'm not really interested. Yes, yeah, <laughs> we understand. <laughs> no, no, but what? God, I always try to listen who come, who is on. Shelly, not so bad, but. Uh, <laughs> oh, Lord. No, no. Daddy Road? <laughs> yes, sir. Listen with Daddy Road, listen with Daddy Road every night. <laughs> <laughs> give thanks, so, give thanks. Oh, boy. I do hope you enjoy the coming year. Same to Thank you, sir. Thank you. And I'll always be listening. All right. Thank you very much, sir. Keep it locked. We, are, we appreciate that. All the best to you for the upcoming year as well. Thank you. All right. All right. Well, if Bye-bye. he didn't call throughout the year, he sure called tonight. Definitely. And definitely, that. definitely. 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 Um, thank you so much. Um, hmm. We do go to the article now. Yep. yep. Well, let's see. Are you having a hard time holding on while having sex? So here are some 20 everyday tips, sex tips, and foreplay tips to hold that orgasm back for longer. <laughs> for a girl, multiple orgasms are a fun thing to experience. But when you're a guy, ejaculating too soon can spell doom to your sex life. You don't have to dramatize a thing, my girl. It's true. <laughs> How dare you come quickly. As a guy, Premature ejaculation can leave you feeling frustrated, dejected, and arm twist you into losing all your confidence when it comes to matters of the bedroom. It's unfortunate that you have to deal with this, but fret not, because there are really fun ways to learn to last longer in bed. Men, are you up and listening? (laughs) It's your time. All it takes is a bit of effort, Cassidy and a bit of time. How to last longer during sex. Worse if the girl don't reach yet, you try wait. If you want to last longer during sex <laughs> and you're not really suffering from a medical condition, then these tips will definitely help you last a lot longer. After all, you need to remember that the experience of sex is more in the head than between your legs. <laughs> well, there's a head down there too, so which head? Upper head, right? Okay. If you feel confident about your sexual capabilities, you would definitely be able to perform better with your woman. Don't let premature ejaculation, Cassidy, get in the way of a great sex life. <laughs> Cassidy looking at me like, oh, class of, there's some class of men, are not, men are problem. <laughs> Instead, <laughs> learn to get better at controlling your ejaculation and everything will feel just fine mm-hmm. and here's a start up tip for you daddy rude uh, you know. if you ever end up ejaculated within a minute rude <laughs> don't hate yourself my darling for it lie back oh my and rest for a half an hour or so who has that time hello <laughs> you will be ready by then and raring to go and you'll definitely last a lot longer and satisfy her better too. Which one is her? Because by that time, mom's gone. <laughs> everyday tips to have sex for longer. Here's a few everyday tips that can help you enjoy better and longer sex over time. Just like a long-term diet and workout plan, these everyday tips won't help you tonight but they'll definitely make you a sex god potential over time. One, (laughs) masturbate regularly. Hell no. (laughs) If you haven't ejaculated for a long time, it'll be harder to hold on while having sex. You can't find one Cassidy over there, sir. Spend some alone, (laughs) and a few time yet. Spend some alone time with yourself at least a few times a week so you never let the orniness get out of hand. (laughs) Masturbate. Annie Palmer, it's out. Daddy Rude. <laughs> Cassidy, number two is yours. Controlled ejaculation. Now, every guy masturbates now and then. I know you do it. I know. <laughs> but how often do you do it? <laughs> Cassidy hates me now. I know. If you have some time by yourself, Cassidy, get busy with a little guy. Well, I don't know if he's small, but don't, but don't rush it. 
spend at least an hour <laughs> watching porn or thinking naughty while masturbating. But each time oh, you're on the verge of ejaculation, you know, you weren't, you weren't reading the article last week. This no, I wasn't. Energetic kind of was with so much that, that punk was that was painful and vigor. This is this is nice. Hold yourself back, Cassidy, and think about something else. Yeah, when you're on the verge of coming, hold it back. Like a stone dog. Yes, the more you practice holding back during masturbation, the better you get at controlling your ejaculation. Because if it's true, you know. If it's true, you can't afford for just like pop off as you enter, just so you get, uh, enter warm. <laughs> just pop off. So the woman already for your pop off yet? Oh, yeah, Who you want go? I England man, Learn fresh from it. Warm to you. Man. Nah, Number man. three, man, speak fresh to your from doctor. England, right? No, man, speak, just want to get some warm. DJ warmth. Flair, speak to your doctor. If you're having a really difficult time making sex last, perhaps you need to speak with your doctor for an immediate temporary cure. Your doctor can prescribe a few pills for you, mm. which can help you last longer while you work on the other techniques at the same time. Did I say DJ Flair? Or probably I should say Prestige. I don't know. All right. <laughs> Number four. I haven't called Prestige name in a long time. Number oh, four. Right. Workout and... What's this word? Kegels? Kegels? Mm -hmm. Workout every day and you'll feel a lot better in no time. This one is for every day. Working out improves your blood flow and makes you feel fitter. And even if you lose an erection because you shot the gun too soon, you will be ready again in no time. Another alternative are Kegel, Kegel exercises. Okay, Brother Gary. This one's to Brother Gary. These exercises are a set of exercises that focus on the pelvic muscles. When you contract and relax your muscles around your pelvis, the pubococcyx one and uh, pub <laughs> muscles and I said I already go but mm -hmm, of your pelvis get stronger over time, and that helps you get rock hard eject erections and gives you better control of your ejaculations. Pubococcyx yes whatever. Five, communication. Mm -hmm. Don't let your early explosions frustrate you, Rude. After all, <laughs> you're not intentionally trying to finish yourself off early. Mm -hmm. Speak to your lover and help each other understand what's going on in both of your minds. Sexual tips to last longer during sex. Mm. DJ, stain them up. Stain her up, DJ. Stain her up. You've read about how to hold on, hold your hard on for longer using the everyday tips. But now we go straight into the act. So what can you do while having sex to avoid an early ejaculation? <laughs> Digital T. One, over excitement. Avoid aggressive or wild angry sex. <laughs> you see this whoop whoop thing now, work out. <laughs> when you lose control of your <laughs> erection, that's when you would lose the erection completely. Try to indulge in calm, slow, and romantic sex by avoiding fast and aggressive sex. Mm. You'd be able to last longer because you won't experience a sudden burst of sexual energy in an instant. So of excitement, no matter with it, just relax. Bill, go easy. I don't want to go talk about William. You're mad. No, you can go easy and not be lame, you know. It's a difference. Lemme, you something can't stand up. <laughs> Number two, take control of sex. When two people have sex, Cassidy, the one on top is usually in control of the movements. So try to spend more time on top. When you're on top, you can slow down, Cassidy. Slow down, go easy, or stop moving completely when you feel like you're on the verge of ejaculating. You listening to me, brother? By holding back when you feel like ejaculating, you can last a lot longer because you're in control of the sex and they will impress the girl even more. Yeah. Three, shift your weight. <laughs> when you're on top of your girl and feel like you're going to blow out, DJ Muki, place your forearms on either side of her and shift your body weight onto your arms. Stop moving in and out and just wait for your little guy to feel relaxed again. 
listen you will be able to push ahead be quiet not a few <laughs> seconds within a few seconds yeah? <laughs> Chongi, number four is yours. You sound complex. Be the, the in pop, sync with your the partner. Pop, Chongi. Chongi, <laughs> this. <laughs> this is where your lover can help you. If she ever feels you throbbing when you're inside of her, tell her to avoid moving too aggressively or even stop moving completely so you can regain your control. At times, Chongi, as hard as you try, you do need some help from your woman to make sex last longer. Don't fool yourself, Changi. You need help. <laughs> Five, control the surrounding. Have sex in a comfortable place, King Mitchell, where you won't feel overexcited. Completely avoid anything that's too exciting, like public sex or anything else that turns you on a lot. If you feel most relaxed in be your bed, stick to the bedroom while you get better control of your orgasms. Don't rush the thing. All right, Mitchell? Yeah, go easy. Six, don't change your pace too often. The boop, boop, boop now work that the rule. Change the pace of, of the to and fro motion when you're inside her feels good for both of you. <laughs> But when you do that, you'll also end up ejaculating faster because the chance in pace, the change rather in pace makes you more horny. Seven, in and out. Cassidy, <laughs> in and out. Some couples love taking the little guy out of the lady garage off and putting him back in while having sex. They do this in porn movies all the time. For many guys, taking the tool out often and reinserting it while having sex helps them stay hard for a longer. Me know something with you, know. Me know you <laughs> but, with that. but at the same time, it will make some guys orgasm a lot faster and frustrate the poor woman and make she just not can't bother to come. Find out what works for you and use it to your benefit. You better stay in there and stop and no move. That if you take out, put it. No, no bother with that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> Number eight, shallow moves. Once you're, you've penetrated the, your girl, don't go ramming her like you're a porn star on heat. Go shallow and easy. Men, are you listening to me? Move just a few inches in and out of her unless you're feeling very confident because longer and deeper moves of the shaft will excite your little guy a lot faster. <laughs> Number nine, wear a condom for crying out loud. Mm -hmm. It numbs most guys don't down there. Mm -hmm. Don't opt for ultra thin condoms. Instead, opt for ones that will help prevent you from ejaculating faster by numbing you down there. Oh, so that there's a chemical in the in the, the, the condom that make you numb, so you don't come so quickly. I don't know if that works for everybody. Number ten. Don't obsess over about your orgasm. One of the biggest reasons why some, so many guys suffer from this on a regular basis is because they spend so much time obsessing over this little problem of theirs. These things happen to everyone all the time, and you'll definitely get over it sometime soon, hopefully. So until then, ignore the thought of premature ejaculation before or during sex by keeping your mind occupied elsewhere. Okie dokie. <laughs> and that's where I end. <laughs> Control your breathing, of course. Oh, Denise in New Jersey. Hey, Denise. How you doing? Uh, Miss Cleo, I have an advice for almost all the styles DJ. <laughs> <laughs> Great article tonight. Can I tell you, Denise, I always provoke them every now and again. I don't know who mad at me right now, though. I can't tell. But maybe some people have burned me out tonight. Um... A real man is romantic in making love. Aggressive is when you are thief peace. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> true, true, true. Some truth to that. And uh, you try to prove a thing. It's the first time to try to prove yourself. Yeah. All righty. Well. Hmm. Not all men can hold out for women, especially if he is anxious. And, of course, if the woman is someone who takes long to come, 
yeah or to reach that climatic point it can be very frustrating for some men it takes the man who really really practice certain things to hold out for her so ladies if you're one of those persons who come very take very long to come and the man going come before he just need to prepare himself for either go back or go to round two or if can't manage round two get some but, help but let me and ask, use things to help her get there i have to find out from from a medical practitioner just like how them said the doctor can prescribe something for the man them hold back. There must be something can prescribe for the woman them pop off well easy. It should. I go, I go, I go research it. It can't work that way. Eh? Everything we are jugs up. Oh, who, who, is, who is troubling me now? Lady C? Javine. Oh, boy. Lecky, I left out Lecky, right? Brother Gary, Daddy Stars. Leave Daddy Stars alone. Every day. It's a race. And me always want to win. So if she now come, well, plus if she boring, then her friend might not be so. Why waste time? Oh, Jesus. Oh, boy. The boy, go to your bed now. Yeah. <laughs> Rude. Well, ladies well, we and gentlemen. Well, we are out of time. Uh, men are weak, Carlene says. Not all of them, sweetie. <laughs> Carlene, by yourself, you know. <laughs> Some are. Don't say nothing, Daddy. Don't say nothing. No, me yes. not say nothing. When when, we, when 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 you were reading the rough sex part, we had our moments. Yes, so we just make you have. No, I'm Bill. Yeah, we are, we are, we just got easy, make you not go on cause we know the things set up on a real. Oh boy, we have come to the end of the show, people. We are like ten minutes over, and of course, you know, big and serious real talk. We couldn't have done this without you guys out there. And again, we really, really, really want to thank you on behalf of Cassidy, our engineer, and Chongy, who has been fitting in every now and again. And Shelly. On behalf of Shelly. And, and Prestige. Prestige. Yep. Lady Cleo and Daddy Rule. We'll be signing out until we see you again the first Friday in 20. 18. 18. That's a way next year, can I tell you? Yep. It's been our pleasure serving you, working with you, laughing with you, going through those rough patches, giving advice and laughing at stuff, and of course being serious when, when there are times to be. We had a great year, a great time with you, and we look forward to doing it all over again. All our friends who text us in tonight, all those who called in, those who have been calling over the years, yep. over the years, over the last year, over the months, the weeks. If you just joined in a few weeks ago, everybody, I'm talking to you right now. Once you're listening to Styles and, of course, you're tuning in to Real Talk, we love you and we appreciate you so and, much. And do remember, next month, Starting next month, month we're gonna add a new feature to our show. That's no, what we're gonna call. No, Wait, name again. Forward to it. <laughs> Pandy spot. Pandy spot. Yes. For example, Lady Clear, what would you do? You go home and you see your partner in the act with someone else. Mister, start fling things. Mash up. <laughs> Mash them up, big and serious. Mash up what the things them. Him and she. <laughs> <laughs> would it things them? <laughs> would, would it matter ah. if? Would it matter if it's happening at your place or his place? It should have at my fame place because if I'm my place, I'm going to my things them. <laughs> <laughs> Real talk. Yo. Anyways, <laughs> let me say to our Jamaican AC clubites, Gary, um, Fitzroy, in, Denise. Fitzroy in Florida, rather, Florida, right? Yep. Um, Gary and Denise in New Jersey, all yep. you guys. Thank Big you. Big up, Taria. Tarry, oh my, you see me from the one calling even because and then my text tonight, you know, Tarry, you're not nice tonight, you know. Yeah, big ups to everybody, every single soul who has been there with us throughout the time. My, my, have, um, my heart is warming right now because it's really, I'm a very passionate girl. Yeah, and um, I, I really just appreciate our friends who see us on the road and say stuff. Those who have given their Vox Pops, even they didn't want to, they didn't feel like, but them said, sure, let me just do it. Those abroad who sent their messages to us, boy, trust me, we really appreciate you so much, guys. Really, really from the bottom of our hearts. And of course, there's a song that I thought would be fitting for my very, very special listeners tonight. And because you love us so much, yeah, we can't help but just really love you guys right 
back. So, on behalf of Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude, I'm telling you, live good, love God, laugh, have fun, get silly sometimes because it doesn't hurt. It keeps you younger. And until next year, walk good and make sure so you keep yourself safe on the roads. All right? Daddy Rude will always tell us. We got my wife for life. Happy 2018 when it comes, guys.